Ah, uh, you shot me. I'm in max pain. I'm no longer in control. I'm... I'm fading out. I'm quantum broken. I'm never gonna Alan wake up again. Uh, there's, there's, there's a joke there somewhere. Early Joe? Yeah, early Joe. Actually, I'm late Joe. I, I meant to start much earlier than this. Um, so today's stream has to end a bit earlier because it's, uh, it's Halloween. So, uh, yeah, I won't, I'm gonna take the kids out, so. Stupid kids. Stupid kids. Any costumes worth sharing? Uh, I said what the kids are gonna be, uh, a couple streams back. Uh, Finn is a Grim Reaper. Kate is a Unicorn Princess. Leo is a Dinosaur. Specifically, some sort of T-Rex, and Mila is Elmo. They're all very excited. <clears throat> so now that Chapter Three is nearing completion, I think it's a good time for me to rediscuss how we will release Delta Rune for purchase. My original plan was to release Chapter Three, Four, and Five together. Together. However, the finish line of Chapter Five is still pretty far off, and I don't think anybody really wants to wait that long to release anything, especially me. So, new strategy: no more waiting for Chapter Five. Instead, we are going to focus on putting Delta Rune now for purchase once we finish Chapter Four. What is this bit? What? Now, now we're after this, we're gonna go back to releasing it all together, and after that, it's gonna be back to uh, one one at a time. <laughs> I knew this was gonna happen. Okay, Shimano. Anyway, so I was reading a Delta Rune update on Dragon's Den. Sorry, I realized that was confusing in hindsight. You say when you just banged out that song line from Saga. Has that been brewing for a while? Or did you just did it just appear in your head complete the exact moment? It just appeared in my head at that complete exact moment, yeah. And then another line appeared in my head afterwards, and I was like, damn, the moment's passed. So you went and joined the FBI. Yeah, and then I quit when Logan died. I cried. Do 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 But the moment it passed, and I was like, fuck, I can't say it. But I said it now, so there you go. I got it out. <laughs> Special announcement about what? You have to show up and see. That's the whole point. We're announcing an announcement. Uh, I don't have Epic Games open. I do, I lied. All right, there it is. Okay, start the game already. Hope I don't have to restart my computer. Sorry if it's already been answered, but are you watching the FNAF movie? You know me, big FNAF head? Absolutely not, no. I don't I don't care about Five Nights at Freddy's. Maybe one dead, I'm gonna have to see it because of, of the kids, but who knows. Okay, I have no sound. I know why I have no sound. I didn't change my sound setting. One second. Okay, I have sound now. All right. I had a lot of fun watching the movie. Laughed a lot. Is it a is it a movie for fans or is it an accidental comedy? Five Nights at Freddy's. A special stream announcement. I can't handle the suspense. My weeb. We're playing Alan Wake too. It was all about me. This performance, the dark place was putting on, but I had no control over it. I knew how utterly lost I was. Odd diner? Or how much is a hot dog? A dollar for a hot dog? Three dollars for a two? It's, it's, what? A two dollar price jump for a veggie dog? Pretzels is two dollars and a soda, how is soda more expensive than the dog? Is the bun separately? Since you refused to delete the stream by half an hour for you to catch up on last VOD, can you summarize the ending of last... Of last stream, please. Thank you. I did it just specifically just to fuck with you, Annie. Yeah. Uh, are you okay, Annie? Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Uh, so at the end of last stream, uh, we finished Saga's chapter, and then when we went back home, we switched over to Alan's perspective, and then the cult of the tree attacked. Uh, everything was fine until the cult of the tree attacked, and then. Alex Casey ran off to fight them all and just like murdered a bunch of dudes because he's Max Payne, obviously. Um, I don't know if he if he actually how much he is Max Payne, but he is meant to be Max Payne, as far as my understanding of how this works is. Yeah, the the real the what Max Payne is based on in the fictional story, but who knows how much power he actually has. Um, and so then you play as Alan Wake, even though it's Saga's chapter, and you run through, and then the FPC show up, the control people. Agent Estevez is there, and they take over the case, and Saga is off the case. She's, she's, she's dropped down of fucking traffic duty. She's, she's out. You're out. You're off the case, McNulty. Like, he, she's out. So they um, they took Alan back to the FPC. I don't know if they're taking him to the oldest house or if they're taking him to, a, like, a, a depot nearby or whatever. Um, and Saga is now trying to find Casey because Casey is missing. Um, and she wants to go to the retirement home where Tor and Odin are. 
because uh, Saga showed up right at the end. It kind of weirdly showed up and saved Alan, so I don't know how that worked. Um, there's Casey. And then we switched over to Alan, and we haven't seen anything of this part yet. Nothing at all. So we're just coming through here, and we're seeing what, what's going on. Hard-boiled and hungover. When someone... Okay, this is a spoiler for Max Payne 1, but you've had so much time to play it. It's a mid-story spoiler. When you played Max Payne 1, was anyone else convinced that Max Payne was actually the person who had been drugged with Valkyrie and killed his own family? And you were going to find that out at the end? And then at the end, it was like, oh no, it was actually someone else they sent in? I was so sure that that's where the story was going. And then it didn't. It's a common theory. Maybe it's still, it's still there. Need money to buy books. Light will show you the way. You need help. Good luck. Need money to buy books. There's a dark cloud hanging over your head. Whoa, what, what the... Alright, let's go pick up the phone. The payphone was ringing again. The mystery caller was back at it. I Thank had to find out more. Thanks for summarizing. Also, what the fuck? That was so much plot. That's insane. I know, if it was a weeb game and you said what happened in the last half hour, I would say, oh, just some perverted conversation with one of the waifu candidates. That's kind of gross, but chat really likes her, and it was just something about her underwear. You know, like, that would be it. This wasn't here before, right? These I are new? To answer the phone. Yeah, I'm answering. I'm answering. Alan Wake? Do you know who I am? How the fuck could I? Whoa! There's that famous temper. Lucky thing I'm not a pupper rod. Oh, hold on. The, the the trays aren't being raced. Is there actually a, a stream announcement? There actually is a stream announcement. Yeah, there actually is a stream announcement on the weekend. There we go. Promise, promise. You keep jerking me around, refusing to tell me who you are. You remember? You... Oh, fuck me. Alan, 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 listen. Alan! Uh, Alan! How much do you remember? Did you visit Parliament Tower? Did you find anything there? Yeah. Alice is in danger. Scratch is reaching out to her, and there, there's another manuscript. Not initiation, return. I saw the title page. I, I don't remember writing it. Return? Oh, man, this is what we're after. The Scratch can't have it. Our, our survival, the survival of the fucking cosmic everything depends on this. Come to me. Ocean View Hotel. I left my room key for you. It's right there on the payphone. Remember, the dark place works in lobes and rituals. If the waves keep pushing you away, you just need to find another way in. We go with the flow of this ocean. Catch you soon, brother. Who is this? Is this Scratch? Is this Thomas? Who is it? The Ocean View Hotel. A suspicious oh. invitation to a shady meeting. Right on the money for the hard-boiled genre the whole city was built upon. Okay. Trays are being raced again. That's good. Let's go check out the puddle. Yeah, looks so good. Scratch is suspiciously absent. I think Scratch is already in the story, and we don't know who it is. Like, Saga is Scratch somehow, or the Alan Wake that we've seen in, in uh, that we found on the beach is is Scratch, and this is the real Alan that we play, and it's like, haha, I, I bamboozled you or something? Like, this something is going on. But then we played as the... No, that can't be it. Unle oh. He was covered in blood. Ooh. Hold on. Hold the phone. Okay, potential. Yeah, maybe. The cult. I don't remember this. A forbidden play brought to life. The cult. An unforgettable immersive theater experience. See it live at Ocean View Hotel. Oh, I want to see that. You know what? Near Automata. Musical? No, thank you. Alan Wake? I'll watch anything. There's no clothes in the door on past sins. Close Casey. Yeah, these are new for sure. The third eye. So the environment got updated. Oh wait, hold on. It's This is the same place, right? Hold on, map. Yeah. Huh. So this part changed. This is cool. This is really well the Ocean done. View Hotel. My destination. Wake. Yeah? Hey. Oh, there's a break room over there. Okay. Uh, a bunch of people here now, so I'll say it again. Uh, so it's an early stream today, shorter stream today. Uh, we are ending in four hours from now, almost exactly. 
I need to end five o'clock my time because it's Halloween today and we're taking our kids out. So we're taking the kids out an hour after that and I we want an hour to get everyone ready, which is probably not going to be enough to be honest, but you know, it's fine. We'll figure it out. And then we'll be back tomorrow. Wait, okay, let's, in the interest of the shorter stream, let's, let's push the progress. Oh. Are you going to be good? delivered me back to the street. What did the mystery caller said? Oh. If the waves keep pushing you away, you just need to find another way in. Are you wearing a costume? Yeah, I'm gonna be uh, dressed up as someone who's working on the Witcher 3 video. It's really nice to play pretend on Halloween. This was not right. Or if we go back in and then we go the other way. Hmm. With only dream logic to lead me to the hotel. I look to the neon signs for guidance. Follow the mirror peak neon sign. Mirror peak neon sign. Mirror. The sky bridge above was connected to the hotel. I could be my way in if I could reach it. Oh. What's down here? Can we go down here before? Maybe that's another reason why I was confused about where to point the flashlight. Because these guys, you can point it anywhere on them because they're made of shadow. Oh. Okay. Okay, I got to the answer. Critical thinkment. I saw an arrow. Wait, is this on the map? It's not. Oh, I got it. Never mind. Maybe it was on the map. Uh, oh, yeah, they're on the in the dusk. ER increases the effectiveness of trauma pads by 10%. Um, duration of painkillers by one second is actually pretty good, right? Let's do that one. What's this light? I think it's... The story I was building was fragile. But not that constantly fragile. Constantly under attack. There was no time to waste. The Dark Presence was only a step behind me. Or a step ahead of you. I think it's the light rod shining through him. I think that's what it is. I don't know why, but what, what Alan is going through in a dark place, I don't know if it's, if it's everyone's going to feel that way, or if I'm able to relate to it because I have a lot of nightmares and I also have written stories myself. I'm going to guess everyone can relate to what he's going through, actually. But... Just on, in case, I just want to put that out there. I, I find it quite relatable, what he's doing. He's literally me, yeah. Die. Initiation. I think a lot of this is new, isn't it? Relatable in what way? I can understand the madness. Casey, you're the killer, the cult leader. It's in your eyes. No! He's right. got the wrong man. It's Scratch. There's no time to lose. You're going nowhere.
just wanted it to be over. It was all my fault. I'd had this dark place in my head for so long. Max Payne's back. Sometimes I'd forget the pain was there. Like it was the way you were supposed to feel. I was not in a dark place. I was a dark I place. Was yeah! A dark place. The source of it all. The vessel. Me and the writer. We were the same. This place kept pushing me under, getting into my head, poisoning me with darkness. I had to find a way to escape before it was too late. It was very Max Payne. Too late again. Room 665. I almost said Doom 665. The gun's just lying there, right? Right? Cult of the Word. Is this the right way to go? Really? I didn't coffee a bit Thank you. She learned yes in German. Merci. Did you just say danke? Yeah, after saying I didn't coffee a bit I took a I took a class of German in high school, a uh, couple years actually. Don't ask me to speak it. I I remember maybe five words. It was not a good class. The most fun word to say in German is orange juice, which is said orange in saft. It's so much fun. Can we go in these? No. Don't spread the word. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Wait, why is it just this one? How is that not an issue for all of them? This blippy ass chair. It must be on purpose. To wait, wait, is it, uh, later on, you think Alan Wake is going to be tip tapping, going, There's something wrong with the chairs. I couldn't notice it before. Maybe I even did, but I couldn't realize it. What it meant. What it's going to mean. What I made it mean. You know, like, what do you think? Okay, I don't know what we're doing. This seems right, right? We're, we're on the right path, I think? We can go down. Let's keep going this way. It's not a chair. It's a sofa. Oh. Okay, now we're up here. Wait, wait. I'm worried that we're retreading a, a place we went earlier, and I don't realize it. Okay. Um, there might be some treats that we missed back there. Oh, sh oh okay, well, the treat was death. No. No? No. Really? Well, I was the first one to ever die there. Can we fall? No, we can't. Alright. God damn it. I don't know, man. Is this gonna take over Liza P if it ends well? I'm not sure. If it ends really, really well, this is definitely a contender for Game of the Year against Lies of P. The thing is, though, Lies of P is much more of a gameplay game, and that's why I like to play games. I like to play games for gameplay, obviously. Um, but that doesn't mean I don't like the experiential side of games, and this is a really cool one, so I don't know. I guess it comes down to, is the gameplay of Lies of P so good that it overtakes the unique cool factor of this game? 
Because not only is this really well made, again, I like I, I cannot stress, this is my shit, man. This is my bullshit. Alright, can I stand here for healing? Is it going up slowly? Both lose the Final Fantasy 16? You can't do this to me, man. You can't do this to me. Lamp healing is at a cap. I thought we raised it to 60% or something. Maybe we are at 60%. I'm just misreading the circle. It looks like 50% to me right now. Hold on, let me make thumb and index finger. Oh no, it is above 50. Imagine if this isn't even nominated. It's Choose the Kingdom, Starfield, the Final Fantasy 16, and your least favorite wins. I can't imagine this not getting nominated when Control did a couple of years back. This feels like the video game equivalent of Oscar bait too, you know? All right, you are a friendly Shadow Man. Look how uh, complex and sophisticated our, our video games have gotten, uh, general public. Our game of the year this year had a musical. Ooh, how fancy gamers. Oh, did you just discover other media? Yeah, we did, we did. Oh, it's so good. Also, it's written by someone who's read a couple books. Ooh, definitely growing up gamers. Well done. I like your game of the year. <laughs> Alright, where is it? It's up here somewhere. Oh, it's over there. Okay. <laughs> I love the voice. What's this called? I don't know. Condescending Karen? I don't know. <laughs> Sam, like, actually went to screenwriting school and shit, and it shows, I guess. It does show, yeah. Although, there might be other video game writers that have done the same, but they just didn't have uh, enough control, or it, it was hard to make it work collaboratively. <laughs> Whoa, what? Oh. Ooh, he's a god? What, what the hell happened there? Did he go to screen school between Alan Wake 1 and 2? Maybe he did, yeah. This is a huge step up from Alan Wake 1. Okay, it looked like it was over here. Yeah, there it is. Alright, cool. We got it. Why was that guy so strong? Why is every game of the year contender a sequel? Sequel culture. Liza P is in a sequel. The more cultured choice. The fact that Liza, High Fire Rush and Liza P probably aren't getting nominated is sad. Yeah, they probably won't. They might get nominated for something, especially High Fire Rush. I think High Fire Rush has a higher chance of getting nominated for something than Liza P. But I uh, hope to be surprised. Do you think remakes should would be should be game of the year awards yes R full remakes like resident evil 4 treatment remake yes remasters no remakes that are saying they're remakes but really they're on the level of remaster no but like i know it's it comes back to idea again i'll know it when i see it but yeah full-on like high effort remake should be considered i think okay so we can go down here should we go up to that light or what Sam Lake studied screenwriting before he joined Remedy and made Max Payne that way. He did multiple things on that project, including giving his face uh, his face JPEG. Um, they made that game on pennies. Yeah, so this is what I was... I think that's what I was trying to say when I said other games probably have people who have like gone to school and studied writing as well, but it's very hard to make something collaboratively. Yeah. So this this way it worked out, or Sam Lake had enough, of, uh, had enough pull to control. Or enough control in general. Increases shock knockback force of Alan's shotgun. Flare gun projectiles. Oh, that we flare gun's pretty strong. Let's do that one. Right now, I would be very surprised if oh Dangarampa? I would be very surprised if Baldur's Gate 3 didn't win uh game of the year. That's that would be my top pick for what I think is going to win. It wouldn't be my top pick for what I think should win because I haven't played it, but if I did play it and it was great, maybe I would change my mind. But that's what that's what I think is gonna win. That seems like the biggest um, influential game of the year so far. Like everyone's talking about that. And they just keep relentlessly jerking it off to. Um, like I don't even see people talking about Tears of the Kingdom anymore. In fact, weirdly, I feel like Tears of the Kingdom talk dropped off pretty fucking fast. All right, going in here, no? Hmm. Okay, why yellow? I could see the Ocean View Hotel. I was getting oh, close. There's a light.
Okay, is that what we wanted to do? Hmm, I guess so. Isn't it ironic that we finally got two big forever games that the industry has, has wanted for so long? Starfield and Tears of the Kingdom and Discourse on both died within a month or two. Yeah, the Discourse did... I think the Discourse lasted a bit longer with um, with Tears of the Kingdom than Starfield. Although, if you count the negative Discourse, it's still ongoing with Starfield. But yeah, it is... Uh, they did die pretty quickly, didn't they? Alright, does this go somewhere else now? Or is this more ammo? The light's affected oh. with the light too. Okay, you know what? This feels like the way. Let's let's go somewhere else. Let's go the other way. I think um, Quantum Break uh, Chan is uh, downstairs. I agree that the writing in this game has been pretty good so far. I find it funny that other people say the game has bad writing, or some say it's high school level for reasons. Some people, man. Maybe they're focusing on the parts that are for... As... as shit is this gonna sound. Some of the parts are, are bad on purpose. It's trying to recreate that pulpy kind of, uh, kind of fiction style. Um, and maybe they're not picking up on that. Whereas other parts are, are really good and aren't going for that. So I can see that's there being some confusion there. This is the wrong way. Fuck. To me, it's bad on purpose in a way that makes it good. Because I know what it's trying to do. And the fact that they're nailing that um, is impressive. So I'm not trying to excuse it being like, oh, it's bad, but it's bad on purpose. Like, like no, it, it loops back around to being good because the, I can see the intent. But eh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I just like the game. Okay, is this where we were before? Hey, he's here! How's the memory doing? Sorry, who are you? Kidding. Good to see you, Tim. <laughs> you had me going. Hey, Tim. Cozy place you got here. You know, your disappearance from Bright Falls is still the only thing that folks talk about. Well, that and Deerfest. Is this where you ended up back in 2010? You know about that? Well, I am the sheriff of Bright Falls. Or, I was. Are you related to Sarah Breaker? She was the sheriff of Bright Falls back in 2010. Yeah, she's my cousin. I had a police sketch made of Dor based on my dreams. I sent it around and Sarah recognized the face from an old case file from the 80s. Ooh. I moved out there to look into it and became sheriff after she left to join the feds. Deerfest is still a thing? So Deerfest is still a thing. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's bigger than ever. <laughs> you know, I got zapped here right before it was about to happen. Funny, me too. What was in the case file about Dorr? Not a lot of details in it. A local man named Warland Dorr went missing near Cauldron Lake. Eyewitnesses claim he was struck by a bolt of lightning and just vanished. I never found any official records of a Warland Dorr living in town or anywhere. Another dead end. Hmm, I misjudged this. I thought that you were working with Dorr when his face appeared and you got snapped away. I didn't know what his name was, but it seemed like someone was calling him away. How powerful is Dor? Dor went missing in 1988. Age has not aged. Longevity not human. Alien magic. Uncle Frank would have known more, but he is dead. Not his real name. Hidden meaning. Okay, I was at the. Is anything else new? No, I don't think so. Redheaded woman. So it was these two at first, then the red, and then the blue. So there's gonna be some more here and up here maybe. Sorry if this has been asked a ton, but do you think this is likely? It's likely this game will take your personal and give me your spot from Lies of P. Oh, I was just talking about that a, a little bit, probably just before you joined the stream. Um, I don't. Uh, where are you getting the food from? Hardy looks like the Heinz uh, logo. Um, I don't know if it's going to. I value gameplay very highly. Not that that's the only way to enjoy games, but that's the person I just I play games for gameplay. Um, so I don't know if it's going to take it over. The gameplay in this game isn't bad. I like the exploration. I the combat is uh, growing on me a bit the more we play it. But I don't think it's going to be come or anywhere close to Lies of P. But this has a, a cool experience, cool level design, um, really great writing. So you know, whereas Lies of P doesn't have any of that. Uh, well, also level design in Lies of P is alright. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna guess Liza Peace is still gonna keep it. Do you notice that Alan pull, puts, pulls his hands back when you aim when you're extremely close to the wall and neat touch? He's not doing it now, Annie, sorry. Oh, he is! Oh, I see, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Neat. I thought you meant it was gonna be like what Last of Us does with uh, putting his hand on the wall sometimes. Whoop. Wait, why not just combine these two? Oh! Alright, so this is a little a little loop. Okay, cool. 
Did you realize that both the TV brothers are played by the same guy? I only found out about it today, and I did not realize it at all. Wait, what? Max Payne dialogue back there? What with uh with Quantum Break? Did I miss a did I miss a line? Where? Echo. I miss an echo down here. How do I get there? I don't know how to get there. Or was it this? Was it here? I missed it. This is confusing. I guess it's that's on purpose. All right, let's see. Is it here? No, it's not. There's a. We missed a stash down here, though. Oh, it's a big one. I'm sure you get this all the time, so sorry in advance, but you still plan on making YouTube videos. I really enjoyed your long-form critiques. There's going to be um, at least two videos this year, or I'm done. No no more streams, no more videos. So there's going to be two, or or that's it. Two? Yeah, or else it's not going to be three, or else it'd be Witcher 3, right? Where's my shotgun? I don't have one, okay. Oh, I missed this when I came through. Okay, where's this going? Alright, I missed the echo up here, or I missed it down here. What is... What's this? Okay, it looks like I missed the echo up here. After Alan Way 2, which game will you stream? Uh, I don't think there's going to be another stream after Alan Way 2, and if there is, it's going to be Slay the Princess. And then after that, we're back on break so I can, uh, so I can do videos. Is that it? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Sorry, I missed the chat. This city will suck you dry if you stay here for too long. <laughs> You'll end up a lost soul haunting the streets and alleys. A faded out shadow glimpsed by some other poor bastard on his way toward the same fate. Your broken dreams become a broken mirror, and the twisted reflection staring back at you with all the pent-up anger, regret, guilt, and shame was the monster you could never get away from. Okay, I think that's it. I think now we're gonna go through here. Actually, you know what? What happens when we go through here? So right now, we are looking at a door, and we're going down here, and then we're gonna pop up somewhere here, right? Let's see, where do, where do we go? So we're still gonna be on the map. Oh, no, now we're over here. Oh, damn. It's a grab. What does that say? You lost her. Together? You lost her? Is it just you lost her over and over and over again? Ocean View Hotel. Oh, nice. Words of Lamp. Lucky Strike. Uh, in the headlights, provides a 10% chance to stun enemies on flashlight boost. Restores 5% of max health when using flashlight boost on hostile shadows. Yeah, let's do that. And there was another echo around here, wasn't there? There's an echo back there. Biggest gaming criticism I have of this so far is that the map is a bit shit to move between. It takes a little too long to get into here, and there's this little loading part. The map itself is pretty readable, especially compared to controls. Where's this echo? But, I don't know. Not a big fan of that. Okay, apparently it's right here. Where am I, where am I not? Oh, there it is. Okay. I dream of calling it quits. Hmm? Making a clean break. Retiring. Escaping. Leaving all this sordid misery and terror behind. Getting in a car and driving till you see the sunrise. Somewhere where the sun still rises. Settling down, buying a house, fixing it up, building a life. 
finding someone. It's a fool's dream. It would all go bad. And having let hope in, it would be unbearably worse than this. You can take the man out of the city, but you can never take the city out of the man. It's true. Many uh, Remedy characters are saying this. Cliche. It's not a cliche when it's happening to you. Wait, what did I say? Manhattan, Lake on the Rocks, Shotgun. Hmm. The bar menu caught my eye. Can I have the shotgun? Negroni, Ocean View Cocktail, Old Fashioned, Gin Twist. Hmm. I don't know drinks, sorry. I want to use the light. I there we use go. That shotgun. Ah, that's where we get the shotgun from. Oh. Well, shit. Can I have a shoebox, please? Shoebox? Alright, what, what to drop? Ammunition for flare gun. Is the flare gun uh, loaded? It is. God damn it. Move to quick slot uh, three. Move to quick slot one. Uh, we could heal. All right. All right. Oh, I'm so mad about this. What do you mean, still no? How big is the shotgun? If I discard something, can I pick it back up again? Nope, alright then. Oh, that is a chunky gun. Oh, man. It sucks. Okay, the enemies are much more intimidating in this game than the last one. Wait, what? Where, where, are you in there? Ha ha! Owned, so owned, you can't get me through the door. Ha ha ha, you teleported inside. Broken! Alright. One, two, two. No, what is it? What's the code? I don't I don't remember finding a code. Do I have to write a story about the code? Plot board? Oh maybe maybe it's over there? Oh maybe the, the menu showed the code. Maybe it was uh something about like get into the hotel. Two five five zero Yeah. Oh, he's gone. All right, Millennia. regretting healing. That is a nice looking rolled up carpet, huh? Okay, there's gotta be a checkpoint in here, right? Gotta be. Gotta be a checkpoint. The dark place. Ocean View Hotel. <gasps> Zane? In Zane in the membrane. Wait, what? 
That looks like natural light. What's... Dad upon would like a checkpoint, please. 665, checkpoint. Please, please not a big story bit with all the, all the red. You're about to fight a boss in Dark Souls 2 around the screen. Please, please. Oh, for fu okay, we'll, we'll, we'll eat a painkiller. All right, we did it. All right, there we go. Just the so we don't have empty the- except for the projector. More games. Was the film a message waiting to be played? Play me. Please do more musical. Please do more musical. Please. Whoa. musical you missed the best moment in all of gaming for 2023 that's a shame all right hello who are you I'm the cool Alan Wake This temple, shadow and mist. There's a window in the floor and a door in the ceiling. There's no knowing. Am I standing still or running or kneeling? You're the one who's been calling me. Indeed. I'm Tom Zane. Welcome to the house of Zane. The poet. The diver. You're in Zane. You look like me. How the hell? Or maybe you look like me, you handsome devil. Ooh. The diver was a beloved character I played in one of my films. I'm a filmmaker. A celebrated auteur. I need answers. Why is return so important? What, Al? You, you always get worked up like this. Come on, I'll fix you a drink. We're in this together. Two artists collaborating, remember? Crafting the keys to our escape. Your magnum opus return and its its companion piece, my film. Sharing our, our life-altering visions, a, a melding of higher minds. Creaming up our transcendental work of art. Here, in this room. In this room. You didn't sit together. I whispered it actually. Weep. how the magic happened enough of this bullshit Alice is in danger I need another murder site to go further back to Parliament Tower scratches your wife is safe back in the real New York but scratch is reaching for her through an overlap return is the key to escaping the dark place you need to get it before that freak does <sighs> there's a murder site here in the hotel let the waves of your riding carry you there. Hello? Jesse? They're all to us. If anyone asks, you were never here. Uh. 
am I face blind? Are they supposed to be the same actor? I, I want to ask too. Like, it, I to me, sometimes they look like the same actor, but other times I'm like, it's just someone who looks like a, a lot like him. Fit. I had what I needed from him. There was another murder site in the hotel to guide me further toward my escape. I had to write my way to it. It's the same person? Okay, thank you for clarifying. If it's the same person, why is one of them such a much better actor? <laughs> An idea nagged at me. I could almost reach it. The word whispers from the police radio kept me awake at night. The word through the ether. A murder in the backdrop of a play featuring a murder cult. Ethan? How meta can you get? He said, looking knowingly at the camera. <laughs> I can sense the cult of the word in this. And their leader. Mr. Scratch. Rumored to be Alan Wake, the writer who'd gone missing years before. The hotel was a perfect setting for a Casey story. I was on the right path. I would start at the entrance lobby. Which is most likely not your favorite game to win game of the year? What was the what, what was the winner? Ball's Gate 3? The entrance hall set the mood where everyone had come in. The victim, the murderer, the detective. An idea, clear as a vision, waited for me here. All right, can I leave now and then come back whenever I want? of the cult was cursed from the pre-show ritual on. The cult is an immersive theatrical experience. Uh-huh. You're gonna have to walk me through what that means. Immersive theater. A play where the audience can participate, spread across this hotel. That sounds fun. The cult is a legend. The only written copy of the manuscript lost, the play is passed on as oral tradition between theater companies. Each company only performs it once. The play was said to have special power. You were like kids playing with a Ouija board. And when you call for the devil, he will come. The pre-show ritual, that's it. Set it up, start from the beginning. It's the pre-game. All right, are we gonna do the writing part now? Gotta say, game's pretty long. I know I'm going through it very slowly, but I don't think I'm going at a snail's pace. Someone in chat will say you are, but the game's pretty, pretty beefy. Wake. All right, so now we can go out, and can we just go right back in again? Yeah. All right. Uh, is there a save room here? The office is gonna be a save room. Is control very long? I think. This is longer than Control. I think Control would be winding up by now, wouldn't it? I can't remember how long Control was. Yeah, don't listen to me. I don't really have a strong memory of Control. Why is it always 5 past 10? Alright, shoebox. Good. Alright. Um, I mean, we probably want to keep the shotgun, right? Let's get rid of the flashbang. Can I drag with moving? Oh, I can. Or move by dragging. Uh, let's keep some healing just in case let's drop the flares honestly we're kind of full all right sometimes moving oh it does work okay kind of want to get rid of the shotgun <sighs> we need more inventory space yeah three spots that's it yeah right, let's take the trauma heads out we have some painkillers if we need them you are the only streamer that stops and listens to pat's radio really Alan. Right, am I missing some of the spread? Wow, there's so many of them. What the f- Alright, these are fake ones. Shit. Bombed. Oh. 
you definitely missed the second. I thought he responded like he got hit, but most of the spread must have missed him. I needed to find the key. Ooh. Okay, what do these doors mean? Final the room scene. at the end of the corridor was closed off. It felt significant. Something terrible would happen there. Yeah, so I can. I was yeah. solving the crime and creating it, as every writer did. Pre-show sure ritual. And then I can change it here. Okay, let's let's explore for a second before we do that. Oh, it's one of those things. My grandparents had one of those things in their bathtub. I haven't seen one of those in a long time. Oh damn. I like these freestanding bathtubs. They're very uh fancy to me. Looking good, Alan. Blind mail got him. Okay, so let us see. This is the entrance hall. And we Why do you keep coming back? Oh. The scene changed with the story. Layers upon layers. A play about a murder cult infiltrated by a real murder cult. Who are also doing their own play, a forbidden play brought to life, the cult. Everyone is invited to the pre-show ritual in the ballroom. Big balls only. Okay, this didn't change anything, did it? Wait, hold on, maybe it changed something back there? No, it didn't, okay. I couldn't get in. Yeah, we still need to see something. All right, let's go back to the other place and you and change that scene to to the uh, to the setup. That is not what I was expecting to happen. Okay, uh, move these props to room 104, 225 for the later use in the ballroom play. The prop room had been changed from room 104 to room 225. Well, we can still go into 104 because this is 104 on the key, maybe. Hmm. The troop were busy building their own wicker man, where they themselves would be sacrificed. How good did you say you are doing those find the five difference picture puzzles? Um, I mean, the ones for kids are pretty easy. I'm really good at those. Uh, ones that are designed to be really hard for adults, I'm really bad at. Because usually it's like, oh, there's a blade of grass missing here, or one part is shaded differently, or whatever. Those are really hard for me. Okay, will this key work anywhere else? My guess it'll also work at 205. Uh-oh. Oh. Really? Wait, why? Why? That's... We're on the second floor now. Go on, Got him. Kirby, my beloved. Why are you letting me go into every bathroom? opened on the side do I have a map of this floor I do okay so going through there took me to the second floor 
Investigation we missed in the reception. There's an echo in the stairwell. We're going through there. It's like a little Zelda dungeon, isn't it? I didn't have the key. The ballroom would be the stage of a key scene in the play. 104. Time to blitz. Opinion on the Flax Huron building in New York? I don't know what that is, sorry. You ever see an area so lovely and detailed that you don't know why it's there or what purpose it serves and get sad for the devs who worked on it? Yeah, a little bit. But then sometimes I also get sad for the little bits of crumbs in the bottom of the potato chip bag that don't get to be eaten because they're not worth it. And it's like, oh, they don't get to fulfill their purpose. How sad. Rehearsal in room 219, move to 202. Rehearsal in room 219, move to 202, pre-show pre ritual premiere. Remember, hit your marks, keep your masks on, and make it weird. Really insane you don't eat them? What the fuck? Okay, well, let's move into something everyone's going to agree to then. W one of the chips that has a little bit of green on it, and maybe you eat around the green, but then you're looking at the green part, and you're like, well, I'm not eating that. And it's like, well, shit, like it was meant to be eaten. This poor chip doesn't get to fulfill its destiny. Question, question mark? You, you, people, people in chat eating the most gourmet chips imaginable? You've never had a little bit of green on your chip? No? Really? I mean, lots of people in chat know what I'm talking about. How have you gotten so lucky? Uh, so what? Alright, now, now they're just fucking with me. 209 key. Ah, we opened it from the side, finally. Another mystery solved, Alan. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything else in here. Alright, 209. I think that's the one we just got. 209? There is no 209. This is 209, okay. I'm getting some Resident Evil vibes right now. Have you played PT? I have not played PT, no. Oops. This is where they gather before the play. This is where it began. Rehearsal room. Okay. Where are we? We're close to the ballroom, right? No, we're not. We went the other way. So that's how we go back. So we can go back to, let's go down to 209 first and let's get that done, because we've got a key for that. Hey, hey Breaker. Tim. New map, huh? Yep. Like, I've never been to New York, but I can tell you that this ain't it. I heard you humming again. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't get this song out of my head. It's a real earworm. Do 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 dreams. I know the song you're humming. I know that song you keep humming. It's the theme from Night Springs. That old sci-fi show? Sci-fi horror anthology. I used to write for a long time ago. Look, it sounds a bit nuts, but I think the song is connected to Door. Or, it's my subconscious telling me that this is all pretty out there. <laughs> There's a, a much longer gap between all the lines that he says, I, I guess to make the interaction seem a little more off-kilter and weird. I wonder if that's on purpose. Oh, we're, we're full up on inventory now. It's like, is he done? He's not? The red-headed woman, connected to door, I know her, where do I know her from? Her identity changes, connected to polyhedrons, she will come for me. Hmm. Another bathroom. 
doing the dishes, huh? How are you getting all this food? Someone in chat is asking how he's getting around. I don't know. I wonder if he just keeps seeing the same room. Oh, I love these things. Alright, that's that, right? That's that point of interest. We read that point of interest. We did it. We did it. Oh, there's uh, something special in the ballroom that we missed. Is it only on this timeline, though? Oh. The cult in the play was called the Cult of the Tree. With their deer masks, they were the backwoods echo of the cult of the words urban horror. My guess is that this is still going to be here even if we change the scene. Yeah, so we just don't... Oh, shit! And it's not there on that one, right? Words of Stuff. Expands Alan's inventory by one row. Adds one charge to Alan's flashlight. Marks all nearby resources and points of interest on Wake's map. Oh, shit. Magic pocket. Oh, it was there. This thing here had changed. Fuck, I'm blind. God damn it. Stupid. So stupid, Joe. Just because of OC Joe. Okay, over here. Did we go to 2019? I think we did. 2019 is where we uh, found the, the boob uh, mannequin, right? All right, so scene rehearsal room. We should go there and change that scene to see what happens. And also we should go get this if we can go get it. All right then, okay. I have to pee, chat. I have to pee. This is the ritual to lead you. Why you set up a play in a hotel? Why this hotel? Because the rent is cheap. Is it? No. The ocean view was perfect for this. It's said to be haunted. Dark stories about murder, death, suicide. Supposedly, an actual cult once performed an unspeakable ritual to summon something in the ballroom. Did we summon the same thing? Tapped into something horrifying? It, it seemed... Like it was part of the play, but it wasn't. Does that sound crazy? You don't want to ask me about crazy, kid. <laughs> a haunted hotel. Yes. That's a trope for a reason. Yeah. It's not a trope if you're using it in your writing. Uh, wait, hold on. Where the fuck are we? Oh, yeah, okay, so that closed the door. Alright, let's go to Haunted and see what happens. Yep, seems about right. Whoa. This, go this ghost likes putting on a light show. It's a music theater ghost, the worst kind. Tom Joe? That's what Zane called himself and turned to a ghost, right? Ooh, why two arrows? Interesting. Shit. Nice shots there, Joe. Nice shots. Come on! Dashing the reload is not working. Oh, sh okay.
lot of enemies. Yeah, these guys are friendly. We're good. We're done. Uh, wait, what? There isn't even one here. Different version of the hotel, maybe? Oh, this time the bathtub is gone. Okay, good. Quite the stash. How come there's no water in any of the toilets? Does that break RTX? It's like, okay, so it go, the first arrow is there, then the second arrow, and then the third arrow is over there. So the thing that we want is going to be right in here. No. Night Springs Night Commercial. A special place. A shifting <gasps> space. Existing in a countless number of parallel realities. Sometimes a quaint small town. Sometimes a hulking metropolis. Different every time we set upon the road that leads us there. And yet, like a half-remembered echo of a fading dream, always familiar to us. These are the stories that take place there. More inspiring, macabre, terrifying, heartbreaking, nail-biting, absurd, and thrilling. Sometimes all of these things at once. A haunting new season of mind-bending episodes, written by Alan Wake. I am your host, Orland Orr, and I will see you soon in... Night Spring. Okay then. Logan's gonna be happy. Uh really? Okay. There's there's nothing in here. Lameo Lameo got him? No, there's a thing here somewhere. Where is it? It's in the mirror, it's in the reflection! No, it's not. It's here. It's under here, and we the the stuff landed on it. Oh wow! What the fuck? That is so hard to see. Jo you didn't see that. Paint the town. Uh, sure. Why not? Yeah, you saw. It. Yeah, because I don't have Twitch's bitrate compressing it even more, and it was still hard for me to see. Alright, that's it. Alright, we're done. So we can get into here at some point, but we're not getting into here. So, oh, there's a container here. So now we have the haunting stuff that we can go and use that in all the different rooms. Alright, cool. So do we want to go back to the very beginning and try it? I think there was a couple doors downstairs that we didn't go through either, right? Alright, I'm enjoying this, but it's I'm mostly just uh, playing the game. So apologies for that. I know I'm not talking that much. We should go here and go back down to the, to the bottom. Should we change the ballroom to the haunting first and see what that does? Let's do that. I'm still on my no dunking on you streak, so don't take it as me as as take it like me being rude. I genuinely did see it. This is just you dunking on me without wanting to say you're dunking on me to make it an even bigger dunk. It's a dunk on many levels. Some might even say it's a slam. Oh no! I recognized my writer's room on the stage. I almost dreaded the ideas this would conjure up. Got here. What was the... Dude, right. Got here. What was the scene in this room? Well, this is what we call the writer's room. In the play, it's where the devil rewrites reality whilst God is asleep. Oh. The devil was our star role. I got a big time celebrity to play him. And he was method acting the role to perfection. He never broke well. character, always wore the coat mask. His name was scratched out on the posters. Mm -hmm. And who was this mystery celebrity? Let me guess. Alan Wake? I wish I could tell you. But turns out there were masks upon masks. What? Whoever he really was? Shit got weird when he was around. I don't even know who we're hiring. Some of the crew joked that we'd actually hired the devil to play himself. 
Mr. Scratch is the devil. He was born to play the role. I had to agree with Casey on that. Okay. Ed, who do you think you hired? Answer Max Payne. He's had a hard life, okay? Okay, where are we going? So we're going down there to the first floor, and then we're going to change the rest of the scenes to the haunted scene. Here we go. The music. Oh man, the elephant's back. Down here, right? Yeah, we didn't pass it. That's good. Didn't Ed imply that he thought it was Alan Wake, but it was just a mask, or do I misread this? Yeah, I think that's that's what it's meant to be, yeah. He needs some critical thinking to get there, yeah. I do wonder why he thought he hired Alan Wake when Alan Wake was meant to be missing at that point, though. Who knows? Alright, so now we're back on floor one, right? Yeah, we're down here now. Floor one. So we can go into 101. Do we have the, the key for that? Ugh, Alan Wake, you shot me. I'm in max pain. Shit, waste of a torch. Oh, now I'm missing. Can we do them all? Can we do them all? Ah, uh, ah, uh, you shot me. Um, ah, uh, you shot me. I'm in max pain. I'm no longer in control. I'm, I'm fading out. I'm quantum broken. I'm never gonna Alan wake up again. Uh, there's, there's, there's a joke there somewhere. Minus, we need minus two. What's the yellow? Messed up reflection? Oh, it's that one, okay. Forgot death rally. This is my death rally. You know what? Minus twos are are toxic. Minus. Now you're just minus twoing nothing at all. It's not even a joke. All right, can we go through here? Now nah, these guys are friendly. How do I get back in there? Do I have to ride the elevator back up to the top? Is that how I get in there? Do I ever get in there? Looks like I have to ride the elevator. There's gotta be a way to get in there. Second, second hall, hallway, and everything. Maybe if we change it to haunted, it's gonna open. The devil. Oh, when the fuck did we get the devil? Shit. I didn't realize the conversation gave us a new scene. I would have changed the the ballroom while we we're up there if, if I knew. Okay, so this. Uh only change this area, right? So there's nothing else here? I don't think so. Do Can we open triangle door? We cannot open triangle door. Alright, let's try devil. Aha! This was dark, but the story had to be dark. The devil's path up the staircase was draped in blood. So, before we do that, are there any doors we didn't open down here? Actually, it looks like we got them all. We went up to 111. We went, oh, there's a there's a container back here we didn't open. Why, am I full? I'm full. Okay, cool. Okay, so, yeah, it looks like we got them all. But we didn't go through and change all the scenes. We also missed that container in 101. Let's just go. Scratch. How do you feel about VOD watchers being deprived of our wonderful pins and polls and bets? Yeah, it kind of sucks, right? Sometimes I watch the stream back and I and I see people reacting to a pin or someone buying a marble or something and it doesn't show up in chat and it's kind of lame. A good streamer would record the chat live and then have the live chat to put in the VODs. 
Uh, I actually used to do that for some of the, uh, the past ones. Alright, second floor is meant to have... Hmm, we're not up there yet. I felt the presence of a new idea here. Mr. Scratch, if that's who the actor playing the devil was, had stayed in the hotel. Asking around at reception who got me a room number. Hmm. 666. He had requested that room, specifically. <laughs> the devil had a sense of humor. Or he really didn't. It was funny either way. Yeah. According to the director, the actor hadn't mingled with the rest of the cast. He had only come out for the play. And always in character. Okay, now we're on the second floor? No. Room 666. Okay, so go on. So these are presenting like they're connected, but they're not. Okay, that's interesting. I like that. Make K quote every pin in chat after they're posted. Nah, that, don't put that evil on K. Wait, where the fuck are we? Is this this is all this is our room? Oh shit. Since his presence lingering in the room. Oh, is this the end? Because we didn't explore some of it. I was about to have another killer idea. Ah. Let's talk about the murder. Okay. Let's talk about the murder victim, the lady who was killed in the climax of the play. The leading lady. Well, it was an honor to get to work with her. It was Alice. A grand dame for sure. She went back a long time kept insisting she had seen the long-lost original script of the play. She'd been with this mysterious writer, his muse. That was her role in the play. Oh, holy muse. shit. Is it... She was staying in room 108, where the murder happened. Zane's wife? The set of the final scene, right. The devil comes, an unstoppable force crashing through the hotel through each scene, executed with devastating mastery, and all leading up to him meeting his muse. Turns out he knew her. He'd only joined the play to get to her. To murder her. Murder. Oh, we're running away. So Saga gets to have a boss fight. Alan has to run away from some wind. Okay. I didn't realize it could teleport. My bad. dark presence had come for me drawn to the story i was writing as it grew darker okay those sections aren't very good oh we have a lot of flare gun ammo did we reload the flare gun yeah we did okay there we go all right not over somehow back on the ground floor yeah this was the murder victim the final scene took place in room 108. Do I have anything more to change now? Climax. All right, here we go. Question. 
It's really, really dark that Alan Wake is treating this whole thing as a desperate search for ideas for his book to escape me while people are dead and dying. You have potentially a child that you might not even be realizing. Yeah, it, it really is. You forget about that and then it hits you a little bit as you play the game, yeah. Because we were talking about it a couple streams back, right? He's he's making this be real as he's going through it. And he doesn't even realize it right now, I think. Okay, I don't understand. This way? Moves when I move. Why am I not getting this? Closer? There we go. Enough of that freaking gumshoe dick asking too many freaking questions. Gumshoe? Not letting us proper police take care of it. This is our chance to make the powers that be happy. We'll be set for life. Part of the inner circle. Well, amen to that, partner. I like it. And so will the paternity. The club, the word, our dear friends with many names. The way I see it, it was a lone nut job. A junkie out of his mind on some fancy new designer drug. <laughs> Open and shut case. All we gotta do now is dump the evidence from room 108 in the usual place in the alley. Big Max Payne vibes. Okay. Where do we want to go? Do we want to go back up here and see if we can get some more stuff with uh, Zane's room? Access to Sky Bridge. Oh, we don't want to go back up there. We can go to 108. Uh, we can go back here and get this word. How do we miss the word? How do you even get into the word? Make climax in one of the, the rooms, maybe? Hmm. Let's go see if we can get it. Call it awake. Okay, there's two to try here. There's haunting, and there is... This is the wrong room. Where the hell am I? Oh, I got turned around. Alright, wrong ass room. Okay. There it is. Reserve for rehearsals. Okay, let's change it to the devil. And then it just kills you. This was not the ritual murder site I was looking for. This had just been an appetizer before the main course. Okay, and it's still not opening this. Can I just look through? That would be funny, right? No? <laughs> All right. And what do we do if we change this one to Climax? I changed the story. And with that, the dark place changed. Okay, so it just seems like these are here just for flavor. You can go back and see what happens. All right. All right, let's go do the ballroom. Just so we've seen everything. I miss you early streams. Did Joe play Alan Wake 1 Quantum Break Control? Uh, I haven't played Quantum Break. I played Control when it first came out. I don't really remember it. I did the DLC, and I played Alan Wake 1 American Nightmare and the DLC. Um, last week, in prep for this. Lots of prep for Alan. Same joke, minus two. Oh, there's a lot of them. But where? Okay, it doesn't seem like there's anything new here. Oh, there is. This is scratch mocking me. What does it say? In his room, he will hurt her. Oh no! You know what? I can change it from in here. Delightfully devilish streamer. Oh, 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 oh. oh. This was something out of a horror story. But I hate grabs. Alright, this is not worth it. For some reason they just keep spawning here. Stop. 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 
All right, we read it. Now let's change it. Oh, damn. Do you run from those? Okay, yeah, there's nothing there's nothing in here. This reminds me, I have a bone to pick with you. A while ago, I said, because it was on topic, you can't just do anal, you need to prepare for it. And you replied with the Luke, free to play, by the way, emote. <laughs> and I demand to know what you meant. I have no idea what the fuck I meant. Did I? Maybe I was just fucking with you. <laughs> Are you sure it was me? I don't know what I meant if it was me. Sorry, Kay. Maybe I just thought, what was, what was the funniest expression or email I could put under that? How, how long has that been in your mind for? Oh, wrong way. This way. Wait, it's not that way. It is this way. Okay. Okay, you know what? We're very close to break time. And this looks like it's, it's heading toward a climax. Some might even say... Literally. Um, so, let's take, uh, let's take a break right now. In this room. Okay, right back. Five minutes. Okay, I think I, I think I thought of the answer, okay? I think this is probably what happened. I gotta warn you though, it's not gonna be a very satisfying answer, okay? But and I'm not even sure, okay? I think what was was I talking in the chat while you were doing it? Because I think the only way it makes sense is that I was lurking in Dragon's Den or I came back and caught you saying something perverted as usual, and I just wanted you to know, hey, I was here again without interact without interacting with the chat. So I was just like, hey, hey, hey. she's gonna see that emote, and there you go. La my old daughter. It's a quote reply. Did I say anything before that though? Even if it was a quote reply instead of uh, you went into even more detail about anal sex tonight. No, what are you fucking talking about? Okay, this was a lot more explicit than you made it out to be. Did I say anything before that moment? You start talking about the sound? The sound of getting a, a Deluc? Not before, not before, but after that you started joking about 2.5 millimeter plugs and 6.25 millimeter plugs. Yeah, because I was fixing the audio jack on my fucking computer. I remember it was broken. I had to get a, an adapter port in order to get my headset to work. Joe, what does that, I don't know what that means. There's not even a connection there. And I quote, yeah, the sound they make when you put it in. Yeah, the, the audio hits the brrrr when you try and plug it in. Yeah. It's not my fault you guys thought I was talking about something else. All right, what if we switch this one to the haunted? The plot changed Ooh. the details of the world. You could climb over that. What? Please do not disturb. Yeah, do you think Epic Game Store is gonna get the message? Ooh. That was neat. Beware the drowned lady. Hmm. Do you have any interest in playing Quantum Break and the other Control DLC now, now it's all very connected? Quantum Break for sure. Other Control DLC? I don't know. I'd like to give Control another chance. Free to play, by the way. I'd like to see. Ooh, what's that? Hi, Joe. I just got here, and since I'm not a native English user, uh, so I feel the need to ask, is the special stream happening on the weekend, or is it going to be announced on the weekend? I'm going to be doing a stream on the weekend that is going to have an announcement as a part of it. Yeah, it is a bit confusing, sorry. Even if we finish this game tomorrow, I will do a stream on the weekend. But we might still be playing this on the weekend, who knows. 
His story ends, her story does not. This is the ritual to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you are gone. And it's a special announcement about streams. It is not a video announcement. It's not anything to do with Witcher or any other video or anything like that. Lost on the shore between the forest and the ocean, the owl and the deer reflected in motion in his room. He will hurt her. In hers he is caught. His story ends. Her story does not. This is the ritual to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you are gone. So say it. So says Mr. Stewart. This was the murder site. There was a record oh. at the bottom of the bathtub. Beneath the body. So that's Somehow why... It was important. That's why I kept showing bathrooms. Okay. Huh. Oh, damn. This reminds me, one of the most provocative moments in all of horror gaming, I think, is in Resident Evil 1, when you have to drain the bathtub. I think it's an image that everyone can relate to, and just just very, like, oh, like, oh I don't want to do that, you know? Like, it's, it's pretty tense. Putting your hand in water that you can't even see through. Drown lady. Is there going to be a jump scare when I press F here? Two faucets. Special. Nope. Another step. Somehow I was closer to home. Closer than ever before. It's you again. The FBI agent. Saga Anderson. I'm closer now. I can feel it. You helped me get closer to escaping. Wait. How are you still trapped? We have to click her. We can feel it. You know about the clicker. It can help us. I destroyed the dark presence with it last time. You can help. You can find it. Destroy. You must find it. I can get it to you. I have to understand. Did you write the story? Alice is in danger. I have to stop Scratch. I have to find Return. I need to get back to my apartment. I'm writing a story to get through. Initiation. It's the only way. It's a story. You can do that, You can write out. It lasted only for a moment, like two planets passing in orbit. Hmm. Saga Anderson was helping me. Helping me go deeper. Closer to escape. Somehow. I had to trust her. Okay, there's definitely Arm some timeline tower. bullshit going on right now, right? I had to get back to my apartment, my study. I had to find the manuscript of return. End of part. Do, 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 daydream. I fell asleep beneath the flowers. I think so far, so for Alan, sorry, I think so for Alan only, like, he did this dark space stuff before getting, uh, found on the beach. Sorry, it scrolled up. That's why I thought too now, but now I'm wondering if that's a different saga. If this is, if that's a saga from after the reality shifted or from before he started shifting reality. I still don't know. Lily and I were talking about this last night because, again, she's really into the game. And this is going to get DMCA'd and we're not going to be able to hear this. Fuck. Um, which saga is real? Is is the saga that came to town the one that got changed into the story and Alan changed her story to be more tightly inter interwoven with White Falls and made her daughter die there and all that, that stuff? Or is it the opposite and she used to live there and then she left and this is and uh, and that was the change her forgetting and having a life outside is the change i don't know to me it makes more sense that fbi agent saga anderson came into town and at that point alan wake you know into his web boom now you're part of the story now i'm going to change things Music has been whitelisted for DMC on the street. It doesn't matter. It's still, it's still getting claimed. Every VOD of this game has gotten a claim. What about Casey? Same thing with Casey. I feel like 
So when I when I saw it in Control DLC, I was like, oh shit, Alan in the Dark Place made Alex Casey become real by writing him. And now I think Alex Casey is actually a real person that got caught in the web in the same way. And then he he wrote him. Because I think all the writing that, that, that Alan Wake even did, bef that he did even before he went to the Dark Place is somehow affected by it like it was this was always going to happen so there isn't like oh only after he got into dark place shit went down like no it's it's been his whole entire life because i it's also heavily implied that uh thomas zane made alan wake and he might even thomas zane might even be alan wake as well he even looks the same way so like who knows like maybe that was his way of writing him him out like maybe alan wake is scratched to thomas zane and alan wake has his own scratch too it just scratches all the way down you know like now I think Alex Casey is 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 a real person first, and maybe Alex Casey's life was changed a bit from Alan Wake writing it, but he still existed, and that ties in with the idea that um, he says he can't make new things; he can only change things. Okay, so now we can go into the uh, the building and see a little bit of Alice. I've been stuck on that for literally two years, and I just feel owned because I didn't even start that combo. Someone asked a question, you replied to me literally, out of out of literally everyone. Why do you feel owned? There's, there was no owning there. I agree it's a weird interaction, and I don't know what the hell I meant, sorry. I think it was just I, I wasn't talking before that. I'd have to go back and check. But you shouldn't feel owned. I've owned you in way better ways than that. Feel owned for those. <laughs> Parliament Tower was here, again. Zane said the manuscript of return was the key to escaping. It's over there, right? I had to get it before Scratch did. Oh, now it's on a- wait, is it- was it on that side before? It was, wasn't it? Wasn't it on the side opposite of the phones? And now it's over there. No, because it was during the time I was trying to disprove the horny K theory. Oh, I'm sorry then. Un unintentional uh, upset then. Scratch was closing in. Gaining control. I couldn't let him escape the dark place. I had to keep him from Alice. No saga today? No, we're just gonna go, um with Alan and if we can do a little bit of saga after this then we will but I don't think we're gonna finish uh, a saga segment last time we did the Alan Way chapter and did the this part so I think it's it's good to continue with that did we miss anything looks like just some stashes okay do you like Bayonetta or Devil May Cry more I think I like Devil May Cry more although Bayonetta's combat is better than probably Devil May Cry 1, 2, 3, and 4 I think Devil May Cry 5 has better combat than Bayonetta but I only played it once. Go to hell. Okay, more Alice videos? I like the last one. The last Alice video showed more consideration for character writing than almost every other game I've ever played. It was such a thoughtful written perspective. And, and showed such a higher caliber of writing than, than we usually see. Uh, especially for a character that's barely even in the game. Alice oh, had turned the it's different now. Into a dark room. What do you see? Elaborate? So, what, what, what do you want me to elaborate? One second. No such thing as too personal. The photos are me. Just need to show a glimpse... A glimpses? That looks like an S at the end. What is that? Make sure you see what's beneath the, 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 the surface. So she's in the dark room and she's afraid of the dark. Maybe this is fine. Uh, so the what she was talking about, about being in the shadow of, of Alan and everything, uh, and how she only got work through him, and how she was happy for that, and she had a happy life, but there was also this kind of bittersweet. Um, and just... I'm not going to explain this well enough, I'm sorry. But just the thought that went in from how that character would actually live in that perspective, especially given that that was, wasn't present in the first game at all and we didn't really see much of that, is quite an, quite an interesting and thoughtful take on that character's presence and actually shows that someone thought of what it would be like to embody her and thought, uh, sorry, and took the time to be like, okay, what would the world look like through her eyes? What would she be thinking? Where would she be in this point of her life? And it's not just all about Alan, 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 Alan. You know, it's all about the, the story and where we are. Sorry, that was an unintentional. I, was, I didn't mean that to be funny, uh, if it is funny. Um, for Okay, this is a better way of saying it. 
for that moment in time, Alice was the main character and got main character attention and got main character consideration from the writer and it worked and it was interesting and it showed a depthness to her character that you usually don't see in games at all, never mind for a character that is just on the side and so far hasn't even been in the story. There you go. Hopefully that's enough to explain it. You don't see that in games, usually. Most stories in games, most stories in most media actually, uh, just everything exists in orbit around the main character and who cares about it or the main conflict. And very little thought goes into anything else. The dark place. I needed to get inside the manuscript. The circle rooms, the spiral. Yeah, this is different every time. Interesting. I'm deleting your emails. Barry, is Barry going to show up? Hey, Alice, I th everything good with you back home? Just checking in. I tried to call, but couldn't reach you. You're probably just deep in your creative process. I know how you artists get when you're in the middle of your projects. Everything else disappears. If you can call back and can't reach me, uh, I'm doing whatever is an executive producer supposed to do. Still a mystery to me. Oh, if you want me to help with anything business related to, uh, into your ex exhibition, just say the word, your pal Barry. Oh, seems like Barry might have uh, matured a little bit. Hey Alice, shark circling, they now want to turn what happened to Al into a movie and or a TV show and or get this a fucking video game. I told them to fuck off. Also, in case you hear about this from someone else, a true crime writer named Tammy Booker is working on a book about Al. I hunted down her publisher and told them we'll sue. Don't worry, I've got you covered. Your pal, Barry. Hey Alice, checking in because I haven't heard from you. Everything good back there? I've been trapped in non-stop meetings with no breaks. Open kimono. Uh, what? I have considered peeing in a mug and lunches be damned. What? How these people ever get a movie made when all they do is sit in meetings is beyond me. Your pal Barry. Joined a cult. Hey Alice, you're going to think I've been replaced by an evil double, but I joined. I have joined a cult and I love it. <laughs> Joking about it being a cult, kind of. Blessed wellness retreat. Working with Al or the Andersons was tough sometimes, but these movie biz types are insane. My stress levels were were through the roof, but then I was tipped off about the retreat. The best decision I, decision I ever made. I never felt this good and well healthy. The guy who runs this place, Chester, is a is a, a goddamn miracle worker. Chester? Do we know Chester? Not a wacko in any way. I know you think I'm full of shit, but I have lost a ton of weight. You wouldn't recognize me. Chester says I'm lucky to have ended up here. That something bad would have happened to me if I stayed in New York. I believe him. I wasn't feeling great after everything that happened, especially after those FPC creepos wanted to chat with me. Enough to turn anyone into a conspiracy nut. I hope you are good over there. Come visit any time. West Coast is not as bad as I made it sound in my earlier mails. Your pal, Barry. Greetings from Hollywood. Hey, Alice. I'm more a fish out of water in Hollywood than I ever was in the Pacific Northwest wilderness. These yuppies with their glow-in-the-dark teeth couldn't be more fake if they had six fingers. Every And everything is so fucking great all the time, even when it's, it's in fact the opposite. More than once I've thrown up in my mouth during meetings with these movie exec jerks. But I gotta... But I gotta be here to look after Al's legacy. Everyone wants to gobble up the film rights for the Casey books, and they have moronic ideal ideas of what to do with them. It's my duty to herd this horde of tan zombies into the general direction of something resembling good taste. I'm painfully aware of how deeply Al would have hated ad adaptations if they didn't do justice to his vision. He was a master of hating things deeply. <laughs> for good reasons, I mean. That's why we love loved him so much, right? Anyway, gotta hop onto gotta hop on another video call now to talk about casting. Your pal Barry. That was pretty good too. I don't know. I'm worried the game has won me over and now I'm biased in its favor. That happens sometimes. I know it can happen the opposite too. When a game has so utterly lost me, or it doesn't have to be a game, it could be a story movie, then I start seeing way more flaws in it. It can snowball out. I hope I'm not doing that. For months after Ellen died, I didn't leave the apartment. I was flattened by the confusion, the shock, the, the guilt, fear. I could barely get out of bed. Wrong subtitle, unplayable. You know what, I hate it, I take it back. Barry Wheeler started visiting. He even cooked me meals. Aww. I couldn't stand the guy when I first met him, but he's a better friend than I gave him credit for. And he still checks in. Even after he moved out west.
So this is, um... Oh, fuck. Sorry. I, I, we've played so many games, it's hard to remember this term. Um, character development. It's character development, isn't it? Yeah, it's character development. Part one, the depths. Love is weakness. Trigger when viewer, uh, close, intimate? Okay. Ooh, I like that one. Alice's work had consumed the apartment. Witness? Her whole life. The darker, the better. Need to show the truth on all screens. No such thing as too personal. The photos are me. Oh, we read that one already. Did Scratch even haunt Alice? Or was it us doing this all the time? Okay, that one looks like the... Eh, let's do this one. Alright, let's do that one. It has three on it. One morning, I saw a deer soar past my bedroom window. It was a, a balloon of some cartoon animal. And I looked out at the street below, and I saw a little girl crying. Like losing that balloon had just ended her whole world. Yeah, that tracks. It was the perfect image. The horror of caring. Oh, that's a good line. And that's when I got myself out of bed. And I picked up my camera. The comeback weakness is clarity. Yeah, okay. It was that order then. Okay. There was something in the dark. Phew. Something I needed to see, to show. The more shadows I photographed and filmed, the more I felt like I was on the verge of a breakthrough. I submerged myself in it. I only went out at night. My search became obsessive, but I still had no idea what I was looking for. Two, three. All right, is there more? Or is it the end? There's a world hidden behind ours. A dark tide ebbing and flowing against reality. Faces in the shadows. Fear of the dark is really just fear of what could be. That. That vast paralyzing ocean lamp is off now but photography can freeze reality in a snapshot oh now it's back on put a cage around the infinite and capture it i need to prove those faces are really there No boundaries be ruthless. The realization purpose is strong. It's a door we can't open in a dark place. The full manuscript of a novel. Return. A horror story about the dark presence escaping from the dark place, taking over Bright Falls. I couldn't remember writing it. I had not written it. I would never write this. I knew who had. Scratch. A monster with my face. If this story came true, Scratch would get out. People would die. Destroying the manuscript. It wouldn't stop it from happening. Yeah, it was I him! To fix it. Yes! I could not change the genre of the story. I'd have to work within the constraints set by Scratch. 
I needed someone in the story to fight the darkness. Saga Anderson. I kept seeing her in my visions. She was already in Bright Falls, already involved, but she was not in return. Not yet. I'd write her in, try to stop Scratch within the limits of the horror story. It was almost impossible. It was taking too long. I had not reached the end. Deadline, Alan. Deadline. Okay, I think the Alan that Saga found on the, on the on the shore is actually Scratch. I think that's what's happening. I think when it when Alex Casey got attacked and it cut away, I think that what happened there was that Scratch went out and and chased after him, and then the Alan we woke up as was actually Alan covered in blood, and that's why he was covered in blood because he came through some way. No, this is that. Wait, hold on. Maybe I'm wrong. What what are the lines? What did he say before that? Was he saying Scratch was there? Maybe they're maybe just embodying the same entity somehow. Maybe it's that. He said Scratch was close, and then he looked into the camera with a knowing smirk. Yeah, closer than Casey ever thought possible. The one covered in blood is definitely not Scratch. That's Alan. But it could be Scratch and Alan in the same entity, maybe. Hmm. Or in the same body. Stop me before I could finish my edits to the manuscript. What if you the wrote? The memory of my edits was already fading. <sighs> Terrible things would happen if the manuscript came true. Scratch was there at Parliament Tower, undoing my work. He could use the story to escape. He could go after Alice. What if you both wrote a story though, and there are conflicting stories? Is that why there's conflicting realities? There's two different stories trying to become real because Scratch wrote one and Alan wrote one. And it, but is that with the edits as well, or is it? Hmm. Maybe that's why one reality isn't really set in stone because of the edits, or maybe there are conflicting stories. The edits would 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 work, right? I think the edits would be enough. Maybe it wasn't edited well enough, or the ending wasn't set in stone, or there's mistakes mixed, uh, were missed, or mistakes were made, and that's why Pat seems to think he's in a different reality. Rose is working at the at the diner, but sometimes she's working as a nurse. Why would Breaker just blip out of existence? Saga has a life in Bright Falls, but also a life somewhere else. This is cool. I'm really enjoying thinking about this. All right, should, should we write? Should we do this, or should we go back to Saga for a bit? Let's write and see what happens. Zane has said we worked on Return together. together. That was a lie. Scratch wrote Return. I would pay Zane another visit. He had guided me to two murder sites. I needed a new one to get back to Parliament Tower. A new draft of initiation. Yeah, there's return and initiation, so there are two different conflicting stories, and they're being edited. Is Scratch also editing initiation? Okay, so people who have finished the game, is this worth doing right now? Because I want to switch over to Saga. But is this like short and, and a banger or no? I want to switch over to Saga. It's an interesting... Watch then switch? Okay. switch it slaps i'm definitely not doing another whole alan chapter but maybe this is worth doing right now doors back oh i like door door is very interesting to me
I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me, was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wei. It was to indulge you, but we can stop pretending now. Uh, masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> I don't even think you know who's under your mask. But you know how to make things difficult for yourself. All these rules. Endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. You made me sing. You are so lucky. You know. There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me, someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors, peeking in, reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. The next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wake. Whatever you say. How big is this? What's the scope of the forces at work here? There's Octi to Zane. The masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste. Ati and Dor seem to be on a higher level than than everything, even Wake. Maybe Wake might have more power as he can sh make reality come real through the writing, but he can't control it. Maybe it's not even something you can control. Maybe it's inherently impossible to control that power. But I would say Ati and, and Dor are on similar levels of power when it comes to what they can actually control. How does Iron Man fit into this? The door was locked. Okay. We can't get over there this time. Hmm. Huh. You're friendly. The light at the end of the tunnel. Jumala, that held you close, Tom. Ei muuta kuin on vaan set the granny in the snow. When the panic is biggest, the help is also near. Dor didn't seem happy to see me this time. Hearing the master is the root of wisdom. But don't let the Tom. game get you down. He's playing his role. Maybe put him in your films, Tom, like you have put me. <laughs> what films? <laughs> I'm a fan of your masterworks. Uh, there is Tom the Poet, my favorite, and Uerden Uer is the most famous one, of course. And is it true what I hear, that it's coming back to cinemas? Is there a bottom to this rumor? I need to get back to my apartment. Answer him. Can you help me? Well, plan is half done. You asked me to make sure you won't forget the... the... the, 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 the light pictures. <laughs> the photos you artist wife took. Uh, they are waiting in the shoebox in the basement. What you leave behind, you find in front of you. Okay. Thanks, Adi. Okay, the so door we're... wouldn't budge. 
we're stuck right now. So we go through Jander's room. I don't think there's anything over there. How fucked up is, is my stream presence that I get a little embarrassed sometimes when I'm enjoying a game? Okay, what's that doing? I would find Alice's photos in a shoebox. Okay, can I make this try? Wait, what? The Harry Garrett Show? More floats. Okay, we were here last time, I remember doing this. These were Alice's photos. I recognized the style. One showed the clicker sinking into darkness. The other showed a light in the shape of a bullet. They were important, even if I didn't know what to do with them yet. Screwdriver? Oh, fuck, wrong button. Okay, where am I going? There was a way out through this, I remember. You go down here like this, right? Quick. We went this way last time. And we went up to the right? No? This way. That's the way. This is where we came from, right? Yeah, so we go the other way. I think. I hope. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, here we go. This room's gonna turn into a safe room. Jump scare. This month. Can't believe they made a game about Joe. Oh. It's really fucked up because my real name is. Alright, we can switch reality. We've got the shoebox. Okay, so someone said there was a radio message that we got. I think we saw all the TV. Radio? Which one? Echoes? We're missing one. Alice Wake? No, it's not that one. Are you sure, Chatter? Oh. Is it just the song? I think that popped up, didn't it? Good 
Painajainen hän luoksesi saapuu, hänet verhotu. Oh, you can't listen to it while you walk around? Oh, that's a misstep. That's a misstep for sure. What's the owl's endgame? What's the owl got to do with this? Alright, what was the one down here? Night Springs, Visions, Writer's Journey. Uh, why can't I, why can't I click on that one? No, not allowed that one. We're allowed all of them, except for the new one. Arrow keys. Ah, well done, Cheddar. I don't remember seeing this. How long ago did we see this? I kind of remember Big Fish. Oh, it was a short one. Maybe that's why. Okay, so let's get out of here and let's go back to Saga. Let's see if loading is faster this time, too. Uh, we have to be gone in an hour and 17 minutes. Non negotiable. No matter what, I'm turning the stream off. So. We can't get into too much, but we can see where Saga Story is starting to Anyway, so that's my real name finally said. It's out in the open. Um, let's all keep it to ourselves now, and because some people don't want to know it, alright? This playthrough is now legendary. It dropped. But let's, uh, you know, all move on. Greetings. Does Saga move faster, or does it just feel like it? You Ooh. say you didn't get a good look at the assailants. No. I mean, yes. I, I didn't get any kind of look, actually. I wasn't exactly at my post when it all went down. I, uh... I needed to answer nature's call and got old Terry from the back there to cover for me. I might have taken more time than I should have. It's usually so quiet around here at that time of day. I, I didn't think anything of it. And exactly where were you when the attack was in progress? Well, you know, when I heard all the shouting and things breaking and gunfire, I... Uh, I stayed where I was. What better place to hide than the John, right? I'm pretty sure. Oh, Terry, though. He must be scarred for life. I, I haven't seen him since the attack. I think he ran for it. I, smart. We'll look into it. Unironically, I did see a review where it said Alan Wake 2 really needed an editor. <laughs> it's just such easy criticism just to throw out there and not have to justify in any way. This, this really needs to be, you know, chopped down a little bit. There's a little bit of fat that could be cut out of here. Like, F? Where's the F? OBS is green for me. Works fine on my machine. <gasps> Wait, is it finally open? No, it was this one, wasn't it? Was this one open? Yeah, how many times have we gone through this? It doesn't budge. It was a headline, I think. The review itself was thoughtful, though I vehemently disagreed with it. Oh, if they justified it, that's good then. It can. It's not that it can never be wrong. It's just usually unsubstantiated. Into the skies. Into yeah. The Dancing in the oh, street. Oh, is not good for my old ticker, or the fishes for that matter. Scares them right off. What do you mean your old ticker? What? You're like twenty. What? I need to find my friends again. They've all gone missing. They've all left me. I wouldn't go looking right now. They'll turn up eventually. Like dead fish in the water. Only got the first stream of singing about playing this with my wife. Is it worth it? It's really good so far, yeah. If you're even a little bit interested in what this game is, then I, I think it's a good time. something to cut this. Oh, we need a bolt cutter for that one. Okay. Should we go to the diner and see if there's anything going on in the diner? Yo, RT is on and the water is fine now? Yeah, it's because the uh, uh, transparency is on, or whatever. Uh, it's this option that, that fucks it up. 
Watch, want to see a magic trick? I'll fuck it up again. I'll put it on low. Woohoo! See? It's over there now. This is high or off? Looks so good on high. Did you talk to McReady? He's great. I didn't see McReady, sorry. Here we go, here we go, here we go. New TV, new TV, new TV. Aww. Oh, look at the reflection, though. Oh. Rich. Okay, is there anything new around here to look at? There's nothing new on the map. How do you get into that cult stash? Are you allowed to go into the police station? Yeah, we went into it last time. I wonder if the FPC has taken over the police station. Screwdriver? I no. need bolt cutters. Yeah, I need bolt cutters. Yeah, that's true. That's true. It's pretty true. Or you could just slip through there. Can you not open the door to the diner with the screwdriver? Is that when we need the screwdriver for? Oh! Okay, let's go to the police station real quick and then we'll go back via there. Someone said last stream that there was something on the side of the police station. I couldn't find it. Oh, they're closed. Oh, okay, that's it. Why does an FBI agent need burglar tools to get into places? What do you mean? She's off the case. She's not an FBI agent right now. She's taking Saga off the grid. She's busted down to traffic cop duty. FBC pulled in. Took over. Is the person still reading on the toilet? Oh. No. What the f <laughs> What the f Is the book upside down again? Is there a photo mode? There isn't, is there? Yes, that would work. Don't mind me, just breaking in. Dear Diary, Alan contacted me again today. There was a message for me hidden in the newspaper. He wanted to make sure I was ready for his arrival. What a silly thing to even ask. Of course I'm ready. Duh, Alan. Oh, and Norman got into the dried ap apricots, apricots at work again. I swear we have to fumigate the place. Dear Diary, some guy at the diner got mad that I bought him... Sorry, brought him a piece of cherry pie and demanded a free piece of apple, but he told he ordered cherry. And when I pointed out that he already took two bites of the cherry, he said he thought it was apple. Apple pie and cherry pie do not look the same. Hmm. I told him he could order another piece, but he... Oh, this, this kept going. I told him he could order another piece, but he'd have to pay for it. And he got so mad and started screaming about leaving me a bad review. Like, like I care about reviews. Anyway, I took away his pie and told him baby shouldn't be eating sweets. He shouted a bit, then left. Some people, based. Dear Diary, Cynthia has been acting up lately. I think she's turning into a you-know-what. Lots of you-know-what's popping up lately. I'll keep an eye on it. If, some, if things get out of hand, I can always get out the rifle. I'm sure Alan would appreciate me keeping the place safe. All right. So... I don't understand. I, I mean, I guess Rose could have two jobs, especially in this economy, but it's weird that it's not... Saga didn't talk to her about it. Hmm. Did I miss something else in here or no? What the hell are these? Okay, anything on the map? No. So, lock door. Alright, seems like we can go. Alright, so we're going back to... Oh, there's a cult stash here, too. We're going back to, uh, wait, what the fuck is this? Oh, it's the police station. We're going back th through the woods and we're going over here where it looks like there's a whole ass new area to go through. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. What was all that commotion by the old lodge? It's probably nothing. Ugh. Didn't sound like nothing to me. Yeah, a lot of people died. A lot of people. All right, so we have to get through here to get to the stash. Yeah. All right, these stashes better be worth it. Check if they're eating their burgers upside down? I hope not. You want to put... I think sometimes it's better to put the condiments on the bottom of the burger instead of the top, though. That way it doesn't mess with the temperature of the cheese, either. So you got top bun, cheese, patty, then ketchup, mayo, mustard, whatever the fuck you want. Not all three. And then bottom bun under that. I think that's a, that's the best way to do it. That is unhinged. What's unhinged about that? 
thoughts on raw onion on burger i've never had it i think it would be too crunchy depends on how it's prepared okay we might have to turn the graphics down here because um this is a very demanding area but we'll see maybe it'll be better when we get to the next area oh god oh too crunchy raw onion is crunchy who wants some crunch in their burger i don't want crunch in my burger Okay, if you want some crunch in your burger, you go for it. I don't want any crunch in my burger. I prefer my burgers to be not crunchy. Does bacon not have some crunch? Not a lot of crunch. Depends on how the bacon is prepared. Weak weeb teeth thinks bacon is really uh, crunchy, maybe? The Valhalla Nursing Home, founded in 2014 for Odin and Tor Anderson of the old gods of Asgard fame. For their twilight years built after the return comeback tour flip-flop to be their farewell tour yeah. cut short canceled oh as their agent barry wheeler had managed to coax a few hit songs out of them before that balance lays the demon a couple of others the old men rocked like their namesakes the backstage parties got out of hand there was thick with smoke wheeler squinted his migraine flared, booze and drugs. A rock and roll cliche. They ran off after every gig. Wheeler had security track them <laughs> down to the craziest after parties. Nice. You don't like chips with your sandwich? Not usually, no. I, I have enjoyed that in the past, sure. So, sorry to be this person who has to bring this up. Did COVID not happen in this reality? Because I feel like, is it ever mentioned? Is that something we have to look at now? No one's talking about the quarantine years or whatever, you know? Alan wrote COVID. In Alan's version, everyone got the vaccine and it didn't spread. And then Scratch got his hands on it and said, too unrealistic, I'm the editor, I'm changing that. And you know what? He's right. Oh shit, uh, I don't have- <laughs> Okay, was that more than one? Yeah. All right, where are we going? All right, stash and stash. We actually need some supplies. Let's go see if we can get that stash open. Ranger cabin. Another one? Okay, so it's up there. We walk past it. There are 200 total vehicles in a factory consisting of bicycles and cars. Each car has- Aw, oh, for fuck's sake! Not this bullshit! Each car has four wheels and each bicycle has two wheels. But what about the other- What gears are wheels? There are a total of 750 wheels in the factory. How many cars are in the factory? Aw, oh, no, I don't want to do this! No! 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 If they were if they were all cars, there'd be 850. All right. If they were all cars, so we have to get how many down? 46 wheels down. 46. Is that it? So 46 uh, and there's two wheels each. So what's that? What's half of that? 46. Half of that is 23. So 200 minus 23 is. 177? Is it 177? Please be 177. I don't want to do this. Oh, thank God. Fucking hell. Alright. We need to go bigger. Stick more sim more stick symbols, more graffiti. I want people pissing their pants when they think about going into in, in the woods. Spread the word. That's it's a really is a horror game. Good math, Joe. Maybe a new carrier choice? What's a carrier choice? What? Why is math so scary to people? Because it's the, one of the few objective, like, markers we have for whether you're a fucking idiot or not. <laughs> oh, can't do basic math? You must be dumb. It's not true, though. Like, some people just d don't rock with math that well as others. But still, people will, will think that and say it and use it against people. Alright, here we go. Not true, though. It is true, though. Oh, we went the wrong way. Shit. I want that stash. Oh shit, more enemies spawned. 
Congratulations on doing that warm-up math, uh, cult stash. Now time for the real one. <laughs> Distorted carnival music? Do I have a flare gun? You know what, we've never used one of these. Why? What does it? What does it do? You have to shoot it. Okay, I thought it would just explode if I hit someone with it. Alright, it scared them off. It worked. It's a portable explosive bro. Oh, I did say that, didn't it? My bad. Sorry. I'm the dumb one. Can you lift it back up? If you don't shoot it, yeah. But I shot it. Another lunchbox. Child doll. Oh, dude, fuck off! Mother, may I go outside? May I run and play? I say to you, my daughter, dear, go outside and play, but only in the light of day and only round the tree so grown. Never near the lake may child, my child, and never may you drone. Alright, so, not here. So the boat? Oh, wait, hold on. Never near the lake, so never next to the lake. No, that doesn't make sense. Is it just tree? No. So is it boat? Go on a boat. No. Oh, we make the child drown. Oh, shit. No, we don't. It's heart. Okay. It's none of them? Lamayo got him? Oh, mother doll. Right, so mother stays at home. Mother stays at home. While the child goes sailing doesn't make sense no while the child goes to the heart no while the child drowns that's not right while the child plays at the tree okay okay, okay. what did this do they're gone now oh did it lower the water what did it do wait wasn't there a stash up here oh it's over there Maybe it opened the way to the stash? I feel like I'm gonna have to kill this guy. I got him. Very annoying. Should have explored here before uh, making him spawn. Another cult box. Just open, just open. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, no. Maven memory game. Here we go. It's going to be a 5 1 now, and I'm going to run out of RAM. Phew. All right. The cult of the tree sees everything. Okay, what did it. What did it do? Usually you get a, a bit of loot after sol solving the rhyming um, things. Did it lower the water? It moved some of the toys over there. Have you ever played Among Us? I need to know based off your reaction to that. Not only have I played Among Us, I played it with Jads one day. And Top Lolly killed me. And someone made fun of me on voice chat and I've never forgiven them. Unfortunately, I don't know who it was because I didn't recognize the voice. What did it do? It was probably K. I think this was uh, pre-K. I don't think K was around. What did they say? I, I don't want to repeat it. Chat, am I dumb? What what uh, what uh did this do? Follow the toys. What do you mean follow the toys? Follow where the boat is pointing? The boat is pointing that way. Alright, I'm going here. Oh, nope. shit. Oh, there's more toys here. 
more toys. Alright, more toys over here. Alright, more toys. charming this is not worth the ammo adds one charge to saga's flashlight oh you know what maybe it was all right um staggered or interrupted yeah let's get let's let's do that unironically suck dick joke thanks Kay. thanks put the hand flare over <laughs> all right where are we are you just what are you what are you guys doing? Alright, I I Oh it's red! Okay. Uh, I don't know I don't know what to do. The, the, like, is someone I think Annie said I missed something in a toy pile as well. I don't I don't think we're getting it, chat. I think we're just gonna go. Alright? This is not gonna go well. We have fucked ourselves so hard here. Math? What year did you play? It might have been in Jad's under my dead name. Um I don't know how many years ago it was. It was a long time ago. It was at the height of its popularity among us. Like, within a couple of months of it, like, hitting big. Tor and Odin claim to be my family. I know Logan and I never lived here. But I don't know enough about my family history to say they're not oh, my relatives. That's a nice Mom tree. Mom only ever said my grandfather was bad news. The less I knew about him, the better. That's a really nice tree. I can use this charm on my bracelet. What? Okay. So we were in combat until now. All right. Vote Mayor Setter to sit in office. Setter has to be an animal, right? Oh, I, did. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Is Setter gonna be a dog? They have a dog for mayor, and that's why Setter kills cats. <laughs> Every year they vote. No way. Vote Setter to sit in office. Sit. Oh no. No, it's just Setter a dog. I think Setter might be a dog. What was the rest that they said about Setter? Oh no, oh no. Saga had slid into a nightmare. A growing amount of evidence said her daughter was dead. Yeah. Saga couldn't accept that. Wake said it could be undone, but Wake was gone in the custody of the Federal Bureau of Control. Casey, her only ally, was gone too. She was alone. Agent Estevez had pulled rank on her, stonewalled her, shut her out of her own case. Saga refused to give up. She needed answers. Tor and Odin Anderson would have some. A family visit then. No one could blame her for that. Saga was trapped in a horror story. It was manifesting itself around her like the darkness of a mental illness, pushing her deeper and deeper. Someone said that all of the, the setter posters are here somewhere. Is there like uh, materials found? Radio? Weapon upgrade? Setter for mayor? Mayor Setter will stand up for justice. Mayor Setter is not afraid of the rough questions. Rough. When you ask, Mayor Setter will speak. Oh no, Setter's a dog. <laughs> Mayor will s to sit in office. Setter is better. Setter won't roll over on the issue. <laughs> Setter, <laughs> Setter kills cats. Setter's a fucking dog. <laughs> Weapon upgrade, here we go. <laughs> Bow, bow and bolts. Fires two bolts before needing to be reloaded. How the hell does that work? Bolts launch into enemies will attract bullets fired near them. Thank you, Lily. Pull the string. Hold the fire button to draw the crossbow further to increase damage in, in, on in a straighter arc. Uh, I think we're using the pistol a lot, right? So what's the best pistol one? Hold the fire button to activate auto fire mode. The signal. Okay, we're never doing that. Another headshot. Land two headshots in quick succession to stun an enemy for an extended duration. Um. I'm not that great at landing the headshots, but that is a good bonus. Increased magazine size by 50%. I think that's the best one here. Saga had lost count of how many shots she'd fired, but she was sure it must have been more than she had in her magazine. And yet, 
she'd not run out of ammo. As if the magazine had grown to fit more bullets. She fired again. And that's it. I don't think we have any more. Okay, is there a case for Setter? No, it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it. Wait. Can we profile Setter? I realize I think I know how you feel about having a seat feel having a secret name one of the famous chatters here uses a name I use elsewhere every time you read it out loud I freak for a second who's the famous chatter bike Chan is pretty uh, famous herself Nagast oh I don't know why I walked around like that oh ring the doorbell Old gods are turn five. Oh, it's Rose. Oh, Saga? What's up? Hey, Rose, do you... Hello, Rose. Thought I'd swing by, see the family. Not a bad time, is it? Oh, no. I was just... I can't say because I use it somewhere embarrassing on my own. Reddit? Okay, don't worry. Understood. You know, tidying the, uh... The, um... I'm so glad you're visiting again, Saga. But Odin and Tor can't see anyone today. Tor actually called me over. I was just on the phone with Tor. He invited me over. Sorry. They had a little too much fun on our trip to Watery and need to rest. I need an excuse to get in and talk to them. That's too bad. Okay if I say hi to the other residents before I go. What? Um... Sure. They always love visitors. Come on in. Not smart to be outside when the sun goes down. I love the architecture. I always dreamed of living in a haunted Victorian manor. <laughs> you say that like it's your first time here. Wait, what? Uh, hmm. Just gonna take this ammo, okay? The Valhalla Nursing Home was established in 2014 by the Old Gods Foundation, originally built in 1965 by an unknown architect for the fi Finnish filmmaker Thomas Zane. This manor is steeped in artistic history. I met Odin and Tor Anderson in 2012 in a strange trip that resulted in strange new friendships. I was honored to manage their band as they made their comeback, touring the country and producing revolutionary new music. However, all good things must come to an end. Valhalla is a place of rest. In that spirit, I hope this building will serve as a place where people can spend their golden years in peace and comfort. May it be a home to those who need one. Welcome to, Val to Valhalla, Barry Wheeler. Barry Wheeler really grew up, huh? Unless it's all bullshit. Maybe it's all bullshit. Old gods of Asgard. So Odin and Tor had abandoned everything. Saga, this way. Yeah, I'm looting. The Munsters or Adam's Family? I really like Adam's Family. The Munsters are alright too, but I think I prefer the Adam's Family. The Adam's Family. Another Alex Casey lunchbox? I'll wake the sudden stop, the international bestseller. Oh, it's a little shrine. Wake up! Alan Wake's crime novels have become the sensation of the nation. Join us as we flip through the pages of The Man Behind the Books. Folks Magazine, how, ha how has your life changed since your books became so popular? Alan Wake, I have to do a lot more magazine interviews. Other than that, it's not so different. You are hilarious! I can see why you're a writer. So what do you do to get your creative juices flowing? Writing is a very solitary journey. When I'm working, I like to be alone in a room with my manuscript. There I can wrestle the with the story, get inside the heads of my characters. Ha ha ha! Literally. Sounds exhausting, and yet you find plenty of energy to party, right? Word on the street is you've been out enjoying the New York nightlife. Any favorite spots? I'd prefer if we could focus on my writing. Definitely. Although I'm sure our readers would love to know where they can find New, York New York's hottest writer on a Saturday night. Are you working on a new book? Yes, on some level. I'm always working on the next story right now i'm looking into something different a departure from what people would expect something new be careful with that people don't always like new so what role does the beautiful alice wake play in your work is she your muse alice keeps me stable she's she's an anchor stopping the waves from carrying me too far out to sea uh-oh be my light in the darkness rose uh, <laughs> oh woo alan wake what the I was wondering if you could help me, longing internally. Will you serve? Will serve you pancakes? You were my muse all along, Rose. Naughty Alan. 
Alan Wake, the bad boy of fiction. Best-selling author sets a feisty new tone for writers. Alan Wake is an author best known for his Alex Casey books, a series of thrilling novels that reinvigorated the crime genre. But Wake isn't just known for his literary works. He's also famous among New York's most exclusive clubs as a late-night party animal. This author is redefining what it means to be a writer. Gone are the days of isolated figures hunching over to typewriters in dark rooms. Wake is a man who hits the town in style, a regular at the hottest spots in the city, happy to see and be seen. The people and the paparazzi can't get enough of him. But it's not just his social calendar that makes this writer stand out from his peers. Artists are famous for their tempers, but Wake's is in a completely different orbit. Damaging property, giving photographers black eyes, avoiding lawsuits. This writer is a train full of rage and you better get off the tracks. Really? Hmm. It wasn't just like a couple one-offs? They said it a little bit in the first game, but I wasn't sure the scope of it. Hmm. Maybe it's blown out of proportion for, for clicks? Like a punk rocker, Wake is grabbing musty old stereotypes and smashing them to pieces. This is one rebel to keep an eye out for. Eye out for. Where is Alan Wake? Where is Alan Wake? Where is Alan Wake? Mystery writer mysteriously disappears. The best-selling author known for his Alex Casey novels has been reported missing in the town of Bright Falls, Washington. Mr. Wake's wife, Alice Wake, has not given any comments on the case, but is, but is confirmed but is confirmed to have been the one to report okay her husband's disappearance to the authorities the mysterious sorry the mysteries surrounding the novelist's disappearance don't stop there other individuals from the town were reported missing within a similar time frame it is unclear whether these disappearances are connected wake's literary agent barry wheeler has indicated he has no information to provide despite having been seen with mr wake in bright falls just before the author's disappearance the writer alan wake has a history of violence toward the press and is rumored to have struggled with addiction the story will be updated as it unfolds oh dear you are strong you are successful you are confident oh thank you map uh oh uh oh uh-oh, oh, oh, shit's gonna go down here. I think Rose is gonna turn into an evil Rose. It's pretty quiet in here, right? And wasn't Tor talking about some, some hag? Ooh, looking good, Saga. Oh, thought I'd lost you. Here's some of our residents, or as I like to call them, our little Vikings. Look who swung by, everyone. Norman, clothes. Norman, we have a visitor. Where are your clothes? I'm, I'm headed back to the sauna with Artie. <sighs> Just another day in Valhalla. I should really get back to work, Saga. But feel free to spend some time with Mandy May and Norman here. It's good for them to have company. Tor and Odin are here somewhere. Need to find them. Do either of you know where I could find Tor and Odin? Odin is sleeping upstairs. But your grandpa's been acting crazy. He got electrocuted when he smashed the telephone. Don't make up stories. Tor went loopy and smacked himself in the head with that hammer he's always carrying around. Tor is hurt. Something's wrong with him. Was Tor hurt badly? He never let go of that hammer when he got electrocuted. It looked like a bolt of lightning hit him. Ooh. Wham! Zap! Thank goodness Blum took the hammer away from him. It's not Tor's hammer, no matter what he keeps saying. <laughs> Blum has his moments, even if he is a Russian. Andy May, you can't say stuff like that. Okay. That's some fascinating network, Mandy May. What's your inspiration? Oh, uh, Drugs. I, I don't know. It is what it wants to be. Uh, taking a break from making those little ornaments for Rose. Do you knit? I dabbled when I was pregnant. Socks, mittens, the usual stuff. Oh, how about knitting me some underwear? One more crude remark from you, Norman, and I'll put this needle in your ear. What? How is that? Wait, what? The lunch boxes? Wait, has Rose been leaving the lunch? Wait, what? The Rose are cannon? I thought Artie put on a wonderful performance this afternoon. Oh, me too. But you're always calling him a crazy fit. I respect the art, Norman. How was that noise? Artie, this is your home. You don't need to keep cleaning. I take that mug away, but I know you'll just find it again. Girl, girl, what a once after being told no. Why rest when you are poor to work? 
Uh, and you know Mr. Blum doesn't like it when you take his work clothes. So <laughs> these these two have this Why only one model. From the jukebox? Okay. Yes, box holy ray. Just thinking about it makes my dad's foot waggle. Oh, you lad, I know. <laughs> was he wearing that it, when he was singing? Okay, where are we going, Rose? All right. Lime in the coconut. All right, Adi, you better talk quick because this is not going in the YouTube VOD. Let's go quick. Get it out. Hello there. Saga Anderson. Hey, Pazid. Name won't make the band birds. Even the Swedish name. I'm art. Anything good on that jukebox? We try to do good, but only Prime comes out. <laughs> Music from my Swedish brothers. Old gods of Asgard. My pals. Birkene Vikings. Birkene. Do you know where I could find the Andersons? Oh, you can never know where. Only a seaman can know that. But even the seaman can know everything. Fair enough. Thanks anyway. Were you in band? Minag? No, no. Not so much sweet that it fills the whole stomach. But, uh... We have shared a stage or two. The poet came down to the lake to call to his dear. The clicker. When there was a lady coming down while he was a person with the poet Danica Lalubask. Alright, we can go up or we can uh, out of order. Someone needs this. The hell's a meat basket? For the twilight years, Valhalla, even Vikings need their rest. Everything in this game is so dark. Man, Sir Rose is just letting us walk around now, huh? Alright, shoebox. Why? Rifle ammo. Well, now I know I get a rifle. Thanks, game. What's with laggy UIs lately? On greener pastures now. Lately? Yeah, I feel like there's been an uptick of uh, laggy UIs. The names of the games aren't coming to me, though. Well, how a nursing home is old. Very old. I shouldn't the interrupt him. The government built a bunker here during World War II to watch the ocean for Axis navies and who knows well, what You need a better else. microphone than that. Ever since they sealed the bunker, it's been a hot spot for teens. The Ocean View Motel and Spa, they call it. Ironically, I believe. They go there to enjoy their beer and their vapes and electronic <laughs> cigarettes. Ridiculous. The future is... <clears throat> so, the teens would drink there, do other stuff that isn't appropriate content for you listeners at home, but the bunker has a tendency to flood, especially during the winter. In the 90s, a, a group of teens went down there one Saturday night and got a little drunker than usual. The teens noticed one girl, Nora Hesberg, was missing. They figured she just went home. When Nora's folks didn't find her in her bed the next morning, they called the police. The authorities, they, they searched the bunker and, and found poor Nora floating in one of the flooded passages. She had a real talent for music. Folks say they, they still hear her singing in the nursing home. Nowadays, t teens think the bunker is haunted. That doesn't stop them from going there. The police have tried to lock it up, but you know young people, they're persistent. Now, as for myself, an impartial journalist, I have lived here at the Valhalla Nursing Home for 
five years. And in that time, I have never heard Norris singing. Just the humming of a certain neighbor of mine who has an inexplicable love for Finnish tango. Pat, I think it's time to stop. I'm sorry, Pat. I'm just going to take your ammo, though, okay? This is for me. Yeah. What are these notes? Are these readable? Topic Terry's Clocks Cuckoo? I need I need to talk to Wendy. Beef jerky taste test. Oh. Okay. Joe, how close to you am I right now? I was pretty close, yeah. Have you seen seen Twin Peaks? I have not. Twin Peaks is pretty influential, huh? Comes up a lot. This is this is me streaming in the future. I don't have the key. Joe, four years from now. Wow. Wow. Plus two. Wow. This is Tor's room. Oh God. What? More moonshine. Was this a drunken rampage? This place is a mess. And Tor's not here. I need to keep looking. Donna. Excuse me, miss, but you don't see me barging into your room while you're performing mental and physical strengthening exercises, do you? I thought not. Sorry. <laughs> don't mind me. And now I have to start over. Good for you. I'm gonna take your hand. Breakfast is at seven. Tomorrow will be eggs, toast, grapefruit, orange juice, tea, coffee. Service stops at nine. Lunch at eleven. Tomorrow is borscht with oyster crackers. Oh, you were on the radio. Choice is stewed beef. I will have borscht. Cranberry juice or water is served as well. Service stops at 1230. Odin. Odin's in bad shape. Hey, Odin. He was drunk and watery. Or is this something more serious? Is Tapio here too? Yeah, I'm hoping to see Tapio. Where is he? Sorry, I'm not here. Are you okay? Yep. You're not here. I'm not here. How can I talk to you I'm then? I'm a ghost. Your ghost? On Halloween? I'm a figment of your imagination because oh. it's fitting for the... Am I here? Am I not? Am I part of you? Am I not? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The Sea of Night. To drink from the cup of the wise one, for wisdom to be a seer. I gave up my eye in the light of the moon to, sh to shine and see. The many worlds to madness and beyond, across the dark dreaming sea, the branching paths of the tree. I gave up my eye so many times. We have lived and died and been reborn. We have met here before and will keep on meeting still. Where did I put the eye? Before time, I gave it to Mimir to drink from the well of wisdom, the cauldron. I took out, took it out myself to see, drank the moonshine. He, he who stands on the threshold took it from me. The time will come again, to be writ again. Can you hear me, Odin? What are you saying like that, Saga? Odin Abison, can you hear me? I need to ask you a couple of questions. Odin? He's in no shape to talk. Profiling. Alright, for some reason I think if we profile the, uh, the whole entire nursing home is gonna descend into darkness. So let's go see if we can find Tapio first. The Anderson Farm, 1989. That woman in the painting looks like Mom. Was I born here? Or is this more of the story? What's this? I don't know what this is. Oh, it's an actual dart. That got kind of flat flattened when we looked at it. Okay. Too many hands. This will put a smile back on your face, my dear. Sorry? Hello, I'm Saga. Cynthia Weaver. Hi, Cynthia. 
I'm looking for Tor Anderson. Have you seen him? Tor. Always poking people with his hammer. Oh dear, my lantern. I think I've lost it. Is your... I'll be sure to keep an eye out for it. Is your hand <laughs> Oh no. She's one of them. Oh god damn there must it. There be an overlap here somewhere. I want to find Tapio first. Getting this old really upsets me. I wonder if as I get older, I'll start to become more cool with it. Isn't this a new building? Oh, it's renovated. Getting in is forbidden for your own safety. Time is long for those who wait. But in the end, stand to dance. Sheesh, <laughs> didn't see you there. Ati. Oh, Ati has its own his own buzzer thing. Hmm. That door doesn't belong even. Yeah, that one there? Yeah. Norman? Cynthia? Wait, is there- is Tapio even here? Yo, hold on, what? How is Tapio not here? Is Tapio calling in all the time? Conversation, new choices. Office? With Rose. Need to find the key. Tapio's not real. Riddle through the ages. Over 200 teasers, tickles, and twisters. Hide the thing with a nice little riddle like this. Better than any actual lock. To get to the otter side, 250 otter, this world, puns that help your conversations go swimmingly. Need the key. Okay, let's go talk to Rose, and then we'll do, wait, what was that? And then we'll do, uh, I saw a prompt, and then we'll do profiling. What's the spiral door on the map? Fun. Uh, where was the spiral door? At the top? It's just there, right? Leads to nowhere. Hey, Rose. It is the same Rose, right? Rose Marigold. Is that her name? You said I'd been here before. When was the last time I visited? Let's see exactly what she thinks she remembers. Oh, it's been years. We were all so sad when you left. After the accident. Oh, fuck this. Well, she's... My daughter didn't drown. She's enjoying this. You're remembering wrong. She's at home watching Night Springs with her father. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's useless. Wait. I need to stop the story. Mandy Man Norman said Tor is hurt. Why didn't you mention that earlier? Oh, you mean the little bump on his noggin? <laughs> it's nothing. The residents like to exaggerate. Uh-huh. I need to check Tor's room. Okay, on the one hand, Rose is being really insensitive and she seems to be kind of enjoying this and, I don't know, kind of crazy. But on the other hand, she put that pie guy in his place and that's based. So, I don't know what to feel about Rose. What's in the wellness center? Oh, that's where we provide our health services to the residents. We have a rehab facility, dining area, and beds for special round-the-clock care. To stay young, stay limber. <gasps> That one almost snuck by me. <laughs> little, little bit of gem there? Received, loud and clear. You can always count on your number one fan. Hmm, okay. Uh, profiling, right? Odin. Odin's in rough shape. What happened to him? These are our twilight years. There's darkness in the water. We have our little tricks, and so do you. What's happening? It's never felt this way before. You're all grown up, Saga dearest. And you're back just in time. The forces of darkness are eating <laughs> away at us. We're too old and weak. You have the power in you, like all Andersons. What was that? The power of criticism. Odin was really here. 
we were connected. Are they really my family? Is that why this is happening? Huh. They use um, Saga's real life actress sparingly, right? Sam Lake's been in a fair amount. Alan is all over the shop. But Saga's real life actress, not as much. I found a photograph of you with the cultists. How are you involved? We're too old for this brand of crazy. But we'll drink with anyone who's offering. The cult's been on our asses to join for years. But we already have our band. And those damn fools don't know what they're dealing with. No wonder they want a pair of legends. Tor and Odin are not part of the cult. The cult thinks there's something special about Tor and Odin. I'm hmm. starting to see it too. Yeah, me too, yeah. I've never connected to someone like this in my mind place before. How is this happening? I was glad to answer your call. Vikings are born travelers. You are a seer. You can see the truth. But your grandpa will want to tell you more himself. Wouldn't want to steal his thunder. Tor is in danger. You can save him. Is my mind place more than just a mental technique? Sometimes my mind place even baffles me. Your grandfather, he needs a lozenge. Is there something more than intuition behind it? Yeah, of course there is. Yeah, duh. One thing at a time. Yeah. Tor is in trouble. Once I help him, he can maybe tell me more. Oh, this keeps going. You said Tor is in danger. What's going on? Darkness is drawn to the spark. Tor only thinks with his hammer, never his head. And the hammer is his. The Prince of Fucking Darkness is making a comeback. Ozzy? Tor is marked by darkness. I can feel it. Is he in his room? It wants to take him and then take me. Beware of Cynthia Weaver. Bad things happen in the wellness center. Don't let her drag him under, Saga. Does Prince of Darkness refer to Scratch? Is Tor becoming taken? I need to find him before it's too late. Stop this before more people get hurt. The clicker. I found Wake's clicker. What can you tell me about it? Cut off from Tom's lamp. It washed to the shore. Good work getting the light switch. The light switch is like an amp. You can play rock and roll without it, but you won't blow anyone away. Art, like Tom's writing, can change the world. But the light switch will crank that change to 11. The clicker has the power to change the story. To save Logan. This confirms what Wake said. I can't let Scratch get his hands on the clicker. By Tom's writing, Odin must mean Wake. Unless. Well, that was neat. I like that. Pretty neat. I can't use this yet. Alright, now what? Find Tor. Talk to the end. Busy today. Busy, busy, busy. Oh, bingo. Wait, how are you down here and up? Do 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 Oh, he's gone. All right, how do you do that? All right, so we go and talk to Odin again. No, we don't. What was it? Talk to the Andersons. Find Tor. Do I have to go and do some uh, storyboarding? He's not in his room. I feel like we went everywhere. Do we need to go and find Cynthia somewhere, or try to leave, and then we get norded? Okay, it's probably better that we don't start something because we have to end in seven minutes. So let's just do the case board, and then we'll be. Hello, Yako. <gasps> Looks like another perfect morning in paradise. I agree, Ilmo. A perfect morning for me to drink this coffee I'm holding. Oh shit, this coffee is shit. Yako, did you just drink a regular brand coffee? I did. My perfect morning is ruined. And all because of your shit coffee. 
If only we could have good coffee. Long subtitle. Hey, what? What's that sound? Oh. Ilmo, look, it's the Bright Falls blended organic coffee from Old Deer Diner. Oh wow! I've heard that the health benefits Bright Falls blended organic coffee has no proven effect on eyesight, the sex, energy, sex drive, or eyesight, attitudes toward any animals or natural surroundings. Bright Falls blended organic, organic coffee contains caffeine, animals. which may temporarily increase alertness With and cognitive function. Full of hot coffee close at hand. You are always prepared for what comes next. How does it taste, Yako? Mm. I feel like a million bucks. Thanks, old dear diner coffee. Bright Falls blend organic coffees brewed with care right here in the Pacific Northwest from coffee beans that are sourced locally in Puerto Rico. Try it today <laughs> at Coffee World and the old dear diner, and don't forget to try the delicious brunch special this month only for Deer Fest. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that wasn't here. What, what the? Did it just drip? What? How is it dripping here? It's not doing it now. What's above us? Someone flooding the whole entire house? It's this, isn't it? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh huh. Whole, whole place is leaky. Oh, sh. You missed the puddle on the ground? It's not a puddle, it's some lotion. It's all, yeah, it's all, oh, damn, moldy too. Uh, can I leave? I can leave. Okay, we'll stand here then. Alright, we have a couple minutes, let's see if there's something to do in the case board before we go. Oh, here we go, yeah. might know something about the clicker. With Wake out of reach. This is my best lead. All right, this is a good way to start next stream, and we will recap what happened, what's going on in the uh, in the uh, nursing home or whatever. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay. The announcement. That's not happening until the weekend, Balder. Try to engage with the uh, with the stream title. You know, think critically, with some critical thinking. I fucked that up. You win. You win. Cell phone. All right, I'm gone. See you later. Cell phone. Cell phone. Cell phone. Where is my cell phone? Anyway. Uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Happy Halloween, everybody. Halloween. Halloween. Uh, wish us luck. This is gonna be... This is gonna be really stressful. Mila's coming out, too. Oh, man. Why do I have so many kids? Oh, uh, it's fucking... <laughs> it's important, though. This is why we had... This is why we had so many kids. We have to... Get, we're hitting the whole city. Fucking there's four of them. We have to make it all back. The amount of candy we get feeds them for, for months. Do you know how efficient it is to hit with that that like that houses with that many kids all in one go and it's all for us? God damn. God damn. Anyway, see you later.